with six sided dice. One to three in Russia, four to six US. Oh my god, how do I clear the dice? Why is it rolling like a thousand dice? I'm sorry. Alright, I'm Russia. Well, the guy that just went for coffee has to pick up. <laughs> it sucked. <laughs> I'll be right back. I'm gonna use the restroom. Since I'm the new guy, I'll take the scraps. No worries. Well, it's USA. We, yeah. I'm USA. Yeah, we're just waiting on you to to oh. pick your. There you oh, go. Sorry about that. I, no, it's I okay. It's all right. I need to get some Joe going. Joe in the flow. And now I think Princess stepped away, so we gotta wait for him. I'm surprised they even made it up for this. Yeah, you're usually not up. my dudes we're in all right do we want an exotic opening or a standard opening <laughs> your choice i guess dealer's choice <laughs> oh man what's your best what's your best stuff <laughs> what's your best go for the, uh... <laughs> do you want to win or no the four <laughs> the four AA gun route. Oh, oh yeah, that one's great. Well, I was thinking we could like do a jam. We could do Vibodi's jam. We could do Silent Hammer's special, which is no, please no, please the no. Bal which is the Baltics, <laughs> Bellow, and West Russia. <laughs> the, that that we already saw that how that worked. So <laughs> you, you guys, you guys let me pick Russia. You're letting me pick the opening. I don't know. All right, do you want to do like a jam or the standard 912? Because that would de that would tell me what I buy. You, you decide. All right, all right. Wait, Fiera, what do you think of the... Uh, I've, I've never seen a jam. I've never done it myself. I've never even seen it, so I have no idea how it works. <laughs> or, or what do you think about four <laughs> infantry, one airplane buy? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. I mean, it gotta be, it's gotta be tricky if you lose Ukraine, but, but you know, it's very unlikely, so go for it. All right, I'm going for it. I do like that buy. It's one of my pet favorites, but no one else does it. Yeah. But when it, when it, when the numbers work out, it's pretty fun. <clears throat> Isn't that your main build to do? There, you do like mostly fire build round one. <laughs> Oh, I I used to do it all the time, but on on um, what did it in, in rank I, I switched to tanks now because <laughs> because if you if you fail Ukraine it's, it's yeah, and if you play against very good players it's it's gonna it's be pretty, painful. It's, it's pretty bad, yeah. And um, it's definitely a a dicey build, but uh, hey, we're having fun here. All right. Pitch me on Ukraine as the first battle versus West Russia, because I think this was you, right? That was, uh... What? Weren't, weren't you the one saying that uh, you, you should do Ukraine battle first over West yeah, Russia? Yeah, I would, I would do Ukraine first, and the reason is because if I totally fail Ukraine, uh, I will actually retreat in West Russia. Because otherwise, uh, everything is going to be wiped out in West Russia and you have nothing left then. Mm. That's the problem. Yeah. All right. Let's try it your way. But, Fiera, do you at least, like, strafe West Russia, though, before you retreat? 
I mean, you have to go one round, but do you try and go like a Be second round? Yeah, 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 sure, of course. I mean, it probably maybe if all my. I guess there's not enough there for two. Killed. Yeah, I guess. Okay. I see. In. Yeah, there's been a lot of, uh, it's, it's been crashing a lot on me. I don't know if everybody else is having similar experience. Mine crashes all the time, yeah. It depends, uh, if, for example, for a while I had my settings lower, then it crashed much less often. But it seems when you put the graphics settings high, then it crashes every time you switch the game it crashes basically so hmm. so i have to restart essentially i have to restart the, the the program every time i switch to a new another game we have a tank and a plane left but we have three tanks and two planes left uh continue you want to take out the tank and the plane oh you have oh you have you have what left Three tanks I have three, and a... three tanks and, and two planes. He's a tank and a Yeah, plane. yeah, no, go for it, of course. Yeah, continue, continue. Alright, you got a tank. Yeah, that, that is perfectly fine. That's average. Yeah. Average is two and, and a half tanks, so you can't keep half a tank, you know? <laughs> sometimes I'll, uh... Well, sometimes I'll just retreat with all my tanks. Like, if I get the bomber. Well, it depends what they have left. I mean, if they only have one plane left and you have three tanks, then yes, retreat. But if they have a pl uh, if you have a tank and a plane, it's already. Right, well, are you are so you gonna... put a put a up? put an AA gun there. Really, with two tanks? Yes. Just kind of wastes it, right? Oh. That no, no, it's it's not a waste because that. That means they cannot just. Otherwise, they they just take you to planes for free, basically. Yeah. But now they have to actually use some units there. You put one fighter in each spot. Yeah. I I like it because. Right, what do you do with this? Like, so I've seen some people move Novo to Kazakh, but I don't think that makes sense, does it? It just keeps it in range of China. And puts it in range of Persia and. Yeah. I know that I, I don't see any reason to do that. So. Alright, I'm gonna leave a guy in Burry. Yeah, that's what I do usually. To to fetch the Japanese planes at yeah. the, on a first turn. Alright, friends. Alright. Have you ever done the um, Caesar and 13 build, Robert? What's that? Have you ever done the Caesar and 13 build? No. Um, it's essentially the, the same thing. You can do it with a tank build or with standard um, unit buy. But you send the battleship and the transport to Caesar and 13. You take Jibitar with one unit. And then you just do six on Caesar and seven. Normally you do like a bomber buy, but if you do a tank build, you don't do the bomber buy. Well, a tank build here is not happening because of what happened in West Russia. I'm getting a bomber. Because the tank build would be a mistake here with that with that many units in West Russia. Mm, well, I would say it's never a mistake to do a tank build. Yeah, it's more it is. of a preference style. Nah, if he's got that many in West Russia, it's... yeah. But if you do a bomber buy, um, I like to do a season thirteen. Because the reason the reason is he'll he'll it'll take longer than a tank rush normally takes because he has so many units left and he'll get a shock going. So you need that bomber. We need that bomber. I mean, I'll go to season thirteen if you want. That kind of slows him down too. No, I was just saying, if you if you never tried it, that's a fun build to try. But you don't have to. I like to do it because it forces um, allies in the awkward position. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to put that there. Maybe I will risk the fighter, though, and put one tank there. 
And now he's got 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So I could stack up Corellia. Right? I can get 13 in there, right? He has 16 I can attack it. Oh, and you have 13 I can defend it. Does have sixteen? I don't know why I count the Which fifteen. Which is fine because if, if, if you put your tanks. In, yeah, I, you know, I, 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 it's all yeah. Good. I think it's it's too much for him to go for. That's that's normally my limit. Sixteen is my limit. After sixteen, I don't do it. But sixteen is. I'd on rather he had fifteen. I don't know why I counted it as fifteen. So, so what you could do is you could just place you know three infantry in there or whatever, and then you can always stack it later, depending on how the battles goes. Because if we get really bad dice, yeah, no, I'll just take it with yeah, I'll, I'll just take it. Three take it with one for now I don't need to yeah perfect and also fine. let's say if you claim to rides which it shouldn't but if it does that's also gonna be a no because <laughs> then he's gonna have more than 16 that can attack yeah yes all right so you're saying battleship this way yeah with a transport and I pick mm -hmm. it up from um, Italy or France yeah, I'm trying to think of which one. I guess the one from France. Well, they both, it's the same. Yeah. Do I put it with the battleship? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So the reason why you do this is because it, it forces UK to decide to kill the battleship or the season six or seven. Because USA can no longer attack it with the fighter. They can only send a bomber and a destroyer to take out the battleship, which is not good odds. Yeah. I mean, they could go for it, but it's, it, it's not terrible odds. But the, the UK can take it, though. Yeah, but if they go for it, then they send in naked planes, and then Season 7 survives. Well, they, they have the Destroyer. Really be... They do have the Destroyer. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. You have to send the Destroyer to Season 13 to help, or you have to send it to take out Season 7. Okay. So it's hard for them to do both. All right. If you had a bad season on seven, then obviously it's not as good. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go. We good? Yeah, everything looks good to me. I like it. Amdurf, what's up, Amdurf? How you doing? Happy Saturday. Okay, don't shoot down my fighter, alright? It's always a sad day. There we go. Ooh. Well, the infantry came through. Nice. I swear the infantry shoot better than everything else <laughs> when you do small battles. Sometimes. Do we take zero losses? Nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that worked out pretty well. Seven worked out too. Nice. It'll yeah, lose the cruiser, so you have two subs. Well, he's so got to. Well, I guess yeah, he's got to go. He's got to use the destroyer right. elsewhere, I guess. Mm -hmm. I guess it forces him to either take out season thirteen or not, and most of the time to take out season thirteen. Yeah, you're right. So now what are we either. back? What are we back this? Well, not that far. What are we back this stuff off? Yeah, you send everything to Morocco, in Africa. Just send everything um, further west. And then you can start debating if you want to stack K or not. But I'll say it since we. 
one Ukraine's so good, I would just do mini stacks instead. Yeah, the goal of mini stack is just make it as hard as possible for Russia to trade back with you. Yeah, I'm just trying to see where I should distribute all these guys. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Another tank in Bello and another tank in Ukraine? I would do the Baltic infantry instead of the other tank. That way you can keep the tank okay. All right. All for right. that attack punch. Well, where and then just the Poland or Baltic states. Either one's fine. Do Normally you do Poland if yeah, you do many stacks. Do Poland. Was that enough in each, though? Five. I mean, six. Basically, just want five and six. Yeah, you basically just want to make it hard for Russia to trade with you. Well, he's gonna take one of them. Well, you don't want them to take um, basically two for three. You want the uh, limit him to only one trade. If you can't do that, then normally it's bad to do a mini stack. That's what I'm saying. He's going to take one of them. Mm -hmm. That everybody? Uh, yeah, did you move that tank from Baltic and put in Poland with the other tank? Is this a tank here? Yeah. Oh. Well, let's find them in. Yeah, let's see what they do. The reason I agreed to do these mini stacks is because they didn't buy the tanks, they bought the fighter instead. <laughs> so they have less units that they could use. Well, and also Ukraine. We had such a strong Ukraine that it's... Yeah, no, I'm saying that, that, that it's... It just worked out that way. Um, mm -hmm. I don't have a transport, so... Um, normally with the bomber, you put the bomber in Italy. No. It gets it has a little bit more range. I don't like with, it. Uh, I, I don't like it in Italy. Yeah, well, what's wrong with Italy? Because I want it up in Germany. I want it up closer. Well, you can still reach everything in, that Berlin can reach. Mm. And you can't reach, like, Archangel. You can't reach Season 2 or Season, you know, like... I, I, I don't know. I don't like putting it in Italy. That's like a weird spot for it. Italy can reach Season 2 and Archangel. Yeah, but then it only has one left. Like, I don't... I, I, I like to have it really close to Season 3. With all those fighters. I like to have it close to season two. All right, allies, that turn did not go great for us. <laughs> we, uh, it's all right. It's all right. We, we don't know how to play defense. <laughs> No, we'll be fine, we'll be fine. Just need to think a little bit now. <laughs> I'll do best to do it. I'll to do it. Um, you, you gotta go, I guess, destroyer, bomber, plane, 13, plane, 5. 
Well, I mean, can I either do 13 or can do 7? Either way. Yeah, it's just hard for America to do 13 because they only have a bottom of the fifth each. Mm. Yeah, well, America can do it. Mm. Sort of. Sort of can do it. I think. Sort of, but it's dicey. Seventy-six percent with a destroyer and a bomber. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just yeah, saying. If, it, if you don't, if you don't get that hit that first turn, though, it feels. <laughs> Those subs are super annoying. I'd, 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 I'd vote. Wait, are you sure? Seventy-six percent. I got fifty-two. No, it is. Um, it is seventy-six. It's just likely that you lose both the bomber and a destroyer, whereas the UK probably only loses a destroyer. <clears throat> What'd you buy? Well... Yeah, I'm just thinking that this... The stops a little more annoying, and and if U.S. succeeds, then everything is cl cleared up. So it's sort of nice that way. Yeah, I've just gotten wrecked on the exact same thought process before. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> how did you get wrecked? <laughs> um, I my my bomber and destroyer both missed, and the battleship hit twice, and. Well, Battleship needs two rounds to miss twice, I think. I mean, no, if you... I, I missed the first round, the Battleship hit twice. And then yeah, I understand, but you... you... After I'm, saying, like, I didn't, I'm just saying I didn't kill it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it just didn't... I didn't yeah, okay, kill okay, it. yeah. I'm, yeah I, no, I understand. Yeah. I understand. It can happen. It can yeah, happen yeah, because, yeah. yeah, you can have a bomber uh, or the Battleship take one damage and then you hope to still kill it and you don't get it sometimes. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Yeah, true, true. Yeah. Well, let's see. Yeah. And it's only a quarter of the time, so it's not like it's improbable. Yeah. But anyway, I don't know. You guys do what you want to do. I think you just make sure you have a buy that if fail, we're not getting London turn two. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, okay. Oh, let's buy a couple planes, I think. Yeah, I think so. you buy two planes for sure. Yeah, that should help protect London, I think. Oh, uh, oh I'll, I'll do the safe. I'll do the safe route. Uh, okay. I'll do what you want, do what you want, do what you want. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. You sure I'll, you know, I have no problem going at 13 with my you want to get those subs. Those subs are annoying as hell. Your call. Yeah, no, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I thought about it, but I... I, got you. I think... Uh, I think Princess is right that there's some certain amount of risk that yeah. if if it survives, it can actually take England. Yeah. So I wouldn't want that. So, so let's not risk that. Yeah. Yeah, and then if we end up KGF like that, those two subs will be whatever. Because you can pull <laughs> your fleet through the med now. Mm. Probably not. He has nothing to hit it. Well, I mean, yeah, I can move it to 17, but then what? Then 
next turn 14, America has a cruiser in 12 that can meet up with it as another hit point. And if he wants to throw all his fighters at it, then I'm happy about that, right? They're going to have two yeah. extra fighters in London that can land. Mm, sure, sure, sure. Yeah, okay, I guess we'll, we'll try that. Then. Sure. Maybe a little, scoop, a little scoop of Italy on the way in. <laughs> yeah. yeah, sure. Sure, sure. Let's see. Okay, is there anything else interesting here? I guess not. Oh, not really. I guess the question would... Yeah, you're going to keep your fighters in London this turn, right? Just in case... No, he's... Yeah. We'll see what happens with the battleship, I guess. If, if you kill the battleship in the train, just gun them. I mean, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll kill Oh. Yeah. You're all sixes. In my league game, someone dropped an airship carrier or an aircraft carrier on me in the Baltics. Yeah. On, on turn one and did the stop did the battleship thirteen play. I was like, you cheesy little dude. Oh, come on. So I couldn't kill his five transport. Yeah. Lived with everything. Woohoo! So far, so Tim Walter, Jay Bird, how you guys doing? Um, you gonna bring that tank to Africa now this turn? I think I think I can move closer. Here. Uh, Eastern Let's Canada. Your, your ten transport. This one. Oh yeah, the transport. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you just gotta get out of the way of that sub. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I guess. I guess we could do Africa, right? Wait, he can, well, he can, he can of course bomb it, but I'm not sure he wants to. Oh, he could. I mean, you can go to, like, 11 or Brazil. I don't know, you just gotta hide, I mean, the, I mean, the, thing just gotta is hide that the transport. Where is he gonna put, put the bomber? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, if you go to Morocco with America, but you might lose your transports, because he's got one, two, he's got the planes in range. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, okay, no, I'm not, not going to take it. There's, it, it had, the there's American nothing destroyer, in it. Yeah, the American destroyer could cover 23 if he wants to risk a bomber for one transport. No, that's okay. I, I don't need it in Africa, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. So. No, yeah, I agree, I agree. I was like, you're probably just going to bring the tank back anyway. You just need to hide the transport. <laughs> Yeah, true, true. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah. Ooh, I like that Central America tank. Um, Good use of Central America. Go here. Did you suffer no losses in 13? Yeah. That sucks. Your battleship yeah. missed. <laughs> It happens, right? I don't think where to go with these. Where to go with these. I could go... Here, I guess. Is Egypt safe? The bomber? 20% yeah. chance of it happening, John. 22% chance. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah. No, I don't know. Yeah, not that uncommon, but uh, still a good one. <laughs> yeah, no, I was just hoping he'd lose like that destroyer or something. Oh, 100%, yeah. <laughs> No, the best outcome for me would have been you missed the first round and I hit twice. That, that's, <laughs> that would have been the best outcome I could have think of. Mm -hmm. That's within the realm of like reason. Yeah, that's also a 20% chance of happening. Yes. <laughs> Mm. 
Let me think, did I want something here? He has five units here. Mm. March Madness. What about your 39? 39 Navy? Jaybird is a basketball fan, I suppose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 39, I'm gonna move. I'm, I'm just thinking about this. I mean, this, this Africa situation, so. You're gonna pick up two guys or one? One, one. Because you got both Canada guys for the other transport. Mm, no, not necessarily. Uh, but I'm thinking, what uh, should I take another guy or two to Egypt? Uh, there's four guys. Yeah, actually, I think I do need because there's a. Oh wait. Uh, Americans can't land right now. I think maybe one, you can put your Persia guy in Transjordan if he needs to go towards Africa, but at least Transjordan can get back to India for round three. Problem is, if you drop another guy in Egypt, uh, they can't get back to India for round three. Yeah, I know, but that's, that's probably fine. That's probably fine. Yeah, okay, let's, um, let's, let's do it this way. Or, like, if you take two, can you drop them both in Transjordan? I don't know. Can't get cancelled. Jesus Christ. What is this? <laughs> you having trouble with the UI? <laughs> it, yeah. It, uh, it gives it me trouble, man. man. I just didn't realize that. I was just, yes, yeah, so I've been too. All right, so yeah, we can do it this way. Let's send oh, actually, actually, let's do it this way. Wait, do we need? Huh. I'm going to help Caucasus a little bit with this guy, and I'm going to move another maybe two guys here. Like this. Okay, let's see what else. This guy comes back to UK. Comes back to UK as well. Like this. Well, the land of an Iceland. Well, I, I guess it could. Yeah, it could. I'm just thinking about it. Well, let's see. Iceland, one, two, three. Two, three, four. Mm, well, he can he can reach a bomber. I don't I don't know if he wants to do it, but um, I'm gonna hold West Russia or no? No, it's a little bit suspicious. West Russia is suspicious. I think just... the fighter from Iceland can be in Moscow next turn. Or yeah, no, I understand. I understand. I I guess he's not gonna. I guess he's not gonna. Oh wait, no, I can't land in Iceland. No, it doesn't reach. So it'll be okay. Won't reach Iceland. I think that's all that I can move. See anything else? Yeah, okay, go again. Looks like we're going to do Pearl Harbor. Looks like we did <clears throat> do it on. Would you ever not do Pearl Harbor? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do. I've been about you know fifty-fifty on it in my ranked games. I think I don't you you don't want to invite a KJF because I think they're looking to go KJF. So definitely do Pearl. I don't think that invites Pearl. I don't think that invites KJF. Oh, really. it definitely it does. Depends. Like if you attack it and it goes bad, it's going to invite it regardless. <laughs> yeah, but if you take that all out, that extra carrier really is helpful for the U.S. I've found that it's mostly on UK's turn 
if they're going to do KJF or not, <clears> if they're trying to sneak it in, if they're trying to punish a really yeah, good turn. Yeah, but, but if I know yeah. that they, <clears throat> if I, <clears throat> excuse me, if I know that they're leaning that way, like, I definitely, well, I mean, I, I always do Pearl, regardless, but. Like one of the consumers is, is did Jeremy do a bomber buy? Because that's that's an, that's a factor that helps you do Port Harbor. Mm -hmm. I would send five there though. Five? Yeah, to Pearl. Yeah. You know, I, I mean, don't want to lose another pin though. I just want to kill the aircraft carrier. All right. Be good. Happy with it. Yeah, looks cool. Like if Pearl Harbor fails for me, we were losing two planes. Sending that extra plane normally doesn't change much of surviving planes. You're, you're gonna probably lose even more planes. It does make the, it more successful to clear, but... It usually doesn't go really poorly, though. Feeling. It rarely goes poorly. It normally depends on the sub, like if the sub gets a hit or not. That's normally depends on Pearl Harbor. Yeah. Yeah, Jay Bird, I'm with you. Well, the purchase is, is typical. The, the three infantry, three transport. I don't think that invites KJF. I did, I did two infantry. I mean, two infantry is fine. I'm talking to somebody on the chat. I'm sorry. So far, all battles weren't good. You can't complain. See how Burma goes? Yeah. He had a hit back, but that's fine. I'll say that went swell for us. Yeah, that... On both and Jay. Yeah, that's It's hard nice. to complain about our dice. We're making the ally sweat right now. They're furious. We got away with pure light, um, with light, light or harbor. <laughs> yeah. We didn't even lose a unit. <laughs> he does get to keep that sub. I know that's but, not. I know that's not the yeah. you know greatest thing in the world, but that sub sucks. I hate that sub. <laughs> At what cost? He kept it alive. At what cost? I've seen players just submerge that sub. That's a pain. What do you guys... What would you guys like? A standard? Carrier to transport? Three transport? Extra destroyer? Oh, let me let me take a look. Some turn on the game. Black screen. Okay. Give me a sec.
I mean, uh, US round one, pretty much, pretty much for me is a standard build. It's just, uh, uh, it's just a carrier, either two or three transports, two men. And if you, let's see how many planes that the, Oh yes, some planes. So you can you can buy a destroyer also. So two transports, destroyer, carrier, and uh, two. That's what I would go like ninety nine percent of the time. Yeah. Okay. US. There we go. I'll go with that. the bomber too yeah you can use bomber okay. how's that look anything else Looks good. sure that's i think it's fine You said this was a little early for you, right? Once again, you didn't lose the destroyer. That's that's not bad. Fighter in, fighter in India. Um, first round, it's not. Oh, he has a transport there. Wait a second. Um, that's probably. That's probably. You, I, I would, I can even, I would even sometimes put the fighter right there, where the infantry is um here yeah for example guys in Western Canada? Or? Western Canada? No. No, 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 no. Don't, uh, everything to the east. Uh, well, I, I mean, I would, <laughs> I would, I would uh, try to ship everything over as quickly as possible to Germany or to, to Africa. Um, because at least, at least this is my, my thinking is that Okay, so he takes Alaska. It's not a big deal. You can just build a couple of dudes in West US and take it back. So it's it's not a big deal, basically. How's that? Okay. I would even. I would even move the uh, the Alaska dude east. He doesn't need to stand there. Okay, all set. 
Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Beautiful. That's good. Princess, are you there? Yeah. Is it my turn? Mm -hmm. Sorry, I was over in a different game. Taking a peek. Oh, all right. So, no fighter support. Zink cuts off. Did you attack something? No. Which of these stacks do we want to hit? Do we want to be greedy and try and go for two? Um, no, probably. I would say probably not. Um, Can dudes or grab the artillery? Let let let's see. Actually, how many you have? To... So you have uh, you have fifteen. You have eighteen units that can. I... Hmm. Technically, could do too. I was thinking of Ukraine and Karelia and leaving West Russia open with like a guy. Yeah. Yeah, could I guess I guess it's possible. But the problem with Karelia is that you you can't hit that with a plane. So maybe actually I would I would maybe do not Karelia but I would do the Belarus, Ukraine and Belarus. Yeah, I usually don't get scared by the AA gun, <laughs> but we do have. Well, things. well, you I I think it's uh, in this situation it's unnecessary to take that risk because in Belarus you don't have that risk, so you, you don't really care that much about Karelia. Okay, so we can build two units there, but I think it's not a big deal. Ah, uh, okay, so what does this look like? Four and two and four and one? I want like six. Well, you. Let me see. Let me see what my computer says. <laughs> You, um, well, well, one thing what I would have, uh, by the way, just to, just as a, as a side note, would have done purchase, first time purchase, I would have bought two artillery and two infantry. You, you did have two money left over. Yeah, so that I would have allowed you. Yeah, I usually save the two, because sometimes I'll, what I'll do is the, like, I'll do like uh, six and two tanks. Yeah, I understand, but, um, but, but the, the idea of artillery is that you can then, you know, hit him back, punish him if, if he leaves stuff like that. Yeah. So right now you only have two artillery, then you would have had four, that's, that's the difference. Yeah, I understand. I like, sometimes I do that, Some, but then sometimes I do the four, so I could buy two tanks next turn. I would, yeah, I would, um, with Russia? Uh, like I said, I, I I do now first turn two tank buy, but after that I buy zero tanks with Russia, because they're yeah they're just uh, they're just really expensive infantry. So yeah, it just depends on how the map goes. Because like right now where we save like a lot of dudes played in West Russia, it's like I 
for you. Maybe we can get those two tanks we didn't buy on turn one. You know no, but, but the thing is that, thing is that, yeah, you can buy the tanks, but what are you going to use them for? Because whenever you use them to attack, they're just going to be killed. So yeah. it's much better to attack with infantry and artillery. Uh, they, they give better defense, you know, so... Um, so yeah. that's why that's why I would never buy tanks. So we can also go a heavy artillery build here, like two dudes and four or six artillery, or we can do like six and three, or we can do ten infantry. No, don't go ten infantry. Go like six and three. Yeah, six yeah. and three is good. I like I like yeah. But um, um anyway, yeah. uh the question remains here, so how many do Yeah, let me uh let me I'll I'll tell you in a sec. Let me see. So I was thinking like six guys in artillery in a plane to Ukraine, and probably like five. Yeah, it's probably. Yeah, I think you're probably right about that. Yeah, yeah, six, six, six one and Ukraine. Uh, six one and two planes in Ukraine. That's what I was gonna do. Yeah, and then probably yeah. a similar layout, but like one less dude, one less. No, you need, you also need six in, um, in Bello, I think. Yeah, I do. And you can always retreat if, you know, if, if, uh, opportunity presents itself. Yeah. Well, I think five um, guys in Bello gives us 70%. No, I would, I would, I would go, I would, I don't know. Okay. Your, your decision, but I would go, uh, six. Okay. I would go six, uh, six, one, one in Bella as well, or you know, just one less plane, basically. Oh, yeah. Is this gonna kill all our stuff then? No, no, we hopefully will retreat. <laughs> <laughs> hopefully we'll retreat. Wait, are you saying yeah, us? Maybe. Are you saying, we're, are you saying we're strafing here? Do, uh, yeah, we could, we, we could see how it goes. I mean, if it, if we kill them. And not strafe, it's fine too. But let's uh, let's do Bello first. I, I think. was gonna say Bello first because that tells us whether we retreat to West. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, exactly. Or uh, to Caucus. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm fine. You want to just throw three guys at the Japan three guys? Roll some dice, baby. <laughs> How about one guy at five planes? <laughs> Guang Dong, he's naked. We get that one shot off. We get a plane. <laughs> sure. <laughs> sure. <laughs> no, right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's roll some dice. All right, Bella. walk in A&A &A gun. <laughs> <laughs> it's a walking egg. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, beautiful start. <laughs> oh, my God. We might be able to go again. Yeah, of course. Okay. Go again. That's not bad. We can go again, yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, that's better. Yeah. I think that that could be a actually a retreat here. It could be. Like, let's let, let me see. Map. What's uh, what do we, we have? Left? I need to look at the map. We have one guy. We have two guys in our artillery left. Yeah. Yeah. Retreat. Yeah. Uh, uh, he's got a lot coming in at West Russia. Well, let, let's see how much. Uh, let's 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 look at the. He's map got he's got six tanks oh. and four guys. Six tanks and four guys. Uh, if those dudes are straight. Uh, uh, thing, thing is that thing is that he he puts his yeah, his yeah. stuff oh, yeah, if he yeah, moves yeah. in. Yeah, I like we can that. we can yeah. hit him back. Because we have two we have two guys, a guy from Moscow. We'll take the retreat here, I think. Yeah. And then let's see how we handle. Yeah, because we have enough coming in to West Russia that'll put up a wall a bit. And then we have all of yeah. the dudes we just bought. Yes. Attack if needed. And we bought a heavy attack faction. Come yep. on, Ukraine. Bro. Woo! They're down to a tank and a guy. We got three guys left. 
Or continue? I think we want to continue this one. Yeah, continue this one. Oh, all misses. And we got... So he's down to a tank. I think now we... Uh, okay. Yeah, we have, we have three guys, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So retreat. And I think... think three, me... two... So he's got Let me five. see. He's got six tanks that could hit Caucus. We might get let's, Caucus uh, up on a turn. No, no, wait, 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 wait. Maybe, uh, let, let's consider this. What if we retreat to Westeros? So how much are we going to have in Westeros? No, that's what I'm saying. Um, we'll have six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve with planes. And he can hit with six, seven, eight, twelve, plus his five planes. He could have 17 against our 17 and we had how much? We don't. We have 12 max. 12 max. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. We might want to. Okay, so and not yeah, humans. let's. We we can we can then maybe retreat to Caucasus instead. Uh, so he's, he's to keep the uh, to keep seven. the counter. Basically, basically he 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 doesn't he doesn't have an attack on Caucasus. And no. we're gonna, yeah, let, let's retreat to Caucasus. So if we, he, let him hit West Russia yeah. and we can counter attack. So that's fine. Yeah. The alternative is we just send those dudes to defend in Ukraine and they do better on defense than offense. Mm. Um, He's only got no, three. No, actually, only got three. no, I think, I think, I think our guys will do better in um, if we keep them alive now. I mean, we, uh, they're going to be more useful alive than dead. That's, that's fine. That's we we <laughs> did buy a shit ton of artillery, so. Yes, exactly. So, uh, so we gonna can. Put, I'm going to put planes in caucus. I'm going to move the egg under caucus. Put put every put everything in caucus. Yeah. Um. Do we want any more guys in West Russia, or just leave? Tank also, yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. These guys from Moscow. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, this is this, this looks good. And yeah. You want to leave one guy in Yakut, or do you want to put one also? In no, 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 no. Stuff? Pull everything back. No, don't. No need. It's gonna just kill it. So yeah. that um, looks good. All right, I think this is fine. I'll put in all the artillery in. Uh, Actually, I'll put two. Wait, put uh, put enough artillery in in caucus. Uh, uh, let's see how many you put right now. You put so you have three I there. Put, and I, put, two. I put two. If I put all three, then I have yeah, just, more artillery. Just put one. Yeah. Okay, yeah, you can you can put one in one in, yeah. in Russia and and, yeah. and the rest in. Yeah, okay, this, this is good. All right. That's good. We stopped them from trading with us. Yeah, you, you sure did. You did. <laughs> <laughs> so he has what, like, I think 13, 14, 20, 21. They can attack West Russia. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm just gonna kill those three units. I'm not gonna try and hold West Russia. Um, yeah, but hmm. and then um, eight, twelve. We have eighteen. We have about we have nineteen. If we lose no one, we have nineteen that can go to West Russia. Yeah, but then so it'll, it's actually but it, but it'll all be tanks. That's nineteen. You no, know, it will be um, four infantry with an A and A gun. So we have like twenty. Assuming assuming those three units Russia. don't hit anything. You yeah, don't, you don't assume. Results. You have to assume on they hit average, two. Well, you assume average results. On average, they're going to hit one thing. You know, sure they can hit two or three. You know, I'm is. just saying. I'm just saying yeah. that, that that you can't. If that, you're worried that's about not enough infantry. Hit. It's not enough infantry. I know, but if you're worried, if you're worried, if you're worried about the hit back, because you can just attack with the planes and then go to Korea to defend or Ukraine. You know what I mean, it, it, it's. Really, no reason not to go for it. 
You just send like three infantry, four infantry with all your planes. But my fighters can't land there, dude. Yeah, your fighters can land in Karelia or Ukraine. That's that, where we're gonna go. That doesn't help West Russia. Russia. <laughs> that doesn't help West Russia. No, my fighters. You see, I have five fighters. Depending <sighs> on how this battle goes. But there's no infantry. You did this last time to us. There's no infantry. Remember last time uh, when we didn't have infantry and you stacked up all the tanks and they just kept attacking your tanks because there was no infantry? I mean, sure, like they can always attack. It's fine, but like, they can always attack. Yeah, uh, <laughs> that's also, the point. <laughs> they, the odds. They, they have less than fifty percent odds to to take it. You know what? I'm gonna hold on. You can put in a calculator if you want. But that's a good battle for It's not about it. it's not about the odds, it's about how much material they'll destroy. How many IPCs oh. we're gonna give them to destroy compared to what will they'll lose. That's what they did last time. It didn't matter the chances of winning the battle. That's exactly what last happened time last time. It was last the... time it worked out good uh, stacking um Rush Russia G two because it never happened. Like we didn't stack Rush Russia G two. We weren't able to. We always want to stack Rush Rush or G2 if you're able to. But we're not bad. able to. Like, we're not. We, we're not able okay, to. Okay, it depends on... So, you, it depends on the hit back. If he hits us back on average, we would have 19 that can go to West Russia versus his 20. I'm... Okay. Uh, what I'm telling you is not, I'm not willing to 20, put... Um, I'm not willing to put a stack of my tanks with no infantry in, next to him. I'm not doing that. You have it, That's dude. exactly what happened last a, time. Yeah, have, have four infantry. Well, anyway, those axes, you gotta know when to take certain risks, because if you play the axes conservatively, allies are gonna win the game. They they go, they won the long game. So you have to find a way to win before round well, 8. Okay, so they're not going KJF. So... Yeah. You know, KGF. Right. Doesn't really change much. It's the first three okay. turns are... Okay, so I need the those tanks to come back to defend Berlin. Those mm, tanks exactly. are needed to come back and defend Berlin. Tanks aren't really um, used for defending. They're more used for moving around the map. All right, look. Pressure and... Um... I'm sorry. I don't agree. I'm not leaving my tanks on the front line like that. Sure, but you still want to add more tanks. You don't want to do... I mean, not tanks, but fighters. You want to add another fighter to that Rush Russia attack. There's no reason to leave it out. I just want to kill what he left with as little losses as possible right now. So I lost one, and I got four of his units. See, like, I'm looking at Ukraine, I can't really stack up Ukraine either. But you know what? I can stack up Ukraine because he doesn't have the six. He's yeah, he's stack. got a lot less that can hit Ukraine, so I could stack Ukraine. It doesn't matter which one you stack, Ukraine or Rush Russia, you want to stack one of those. Otherwise, you're basically just waving a white flag at the Allies and we give up. Ukraine is the much better one stack right now. It would have been nice if we would have attacked Season 13 as well with one of the subs. No, I'm going to save these two subs, keep them up in three. Because then he just destroys the subs, and then there's no yeah, subs. Yeah, but you could have attacked it with a plane and a sub or something. You could have but but for what? Destroyer. For what? There's no transports there. Yeah, like, that doesn't... Is you can't buy this destroyer since we still have a sub. Uh, I'd rather just keep the two subs. Yeah. 
move all the fighters out of here. You think, should I, what, what can he hit? He can't hit France right now, can he? So. It's fine stack in Algeria because USA is going to go to 13 easy if you leave Morocco. So you probably want to. All right, uh, yeah, you're probably Algeria. right about that. Yeah, that's probably true. I mean, you can destroy it with the British also. I guess yeah, it doesn't but matter. if he does that, I guess it doesn't he matter. has much troops going to India for yeah. J3. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. That's cool. One thing you can think about is defending Italy, so UK can't get like a cheap, you know, shot in there. Well, he can bring two, three. I'll put three. Yeah, I'll, put three, guys, I'll put three guys. I'll put three guys in Italy, and I'll move this egg on there too. Well, egg gun, if he can bring in three to four, I don't think his bomber can reach, but he can send three fighters. Where are the other fighters? Two in London, and then one in seventeen. See them. Well, he can only land two of them, right? One. Yeah, but he can also. Three, but one four. has. Look at the movements so of those one, three. Okay, okay, so you can bring three to the land units, I guess. What about that AA gun? I didn't really want to put anything in Italy. Well, we, we want to keep those those slots open for us to build. I know, but this, also we don't that, wanna... this infantry needs to go up front. That's That's the thing. We need more infantry up front, like quickly. Well, you don't need to over defend it. Like, just have like one infantry, and then you can build three more on Italy. You think that's enough with the one air any aircraft? Just... Yeah, especially especially with an A and A gun. This is Fiari we're playing against. He's gonna be he's gonna be very um scared to attack an A and A gun with three fighters. Yeah, but he's it's kind of like, like that. it's kind of like a free attack though. It, it is kind of like not a free really attack. Not, but you also have planes. We have fighters and bombers that can re-attack him in that C zone. So it's a huge commitment for him to attack Italy. Yeah, and it he's conservative. He's not gonna do that commitment. But he also might because season thirteen got left alone. So it's easier for him to do that now. But yeah, just one infantry, one an A gun, and then build three. That should be good. Yeah. All right. This is always interesting, whether moving through Poland or Baltic states. I I know. Where I I want them in Poland because I have the stack in Ukraine now, right? So I want to make sure it's next yeah, to Ukraine. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah, you kind of have to think like, what's US going to go? Because if US goes like season two or nine, then. It would have been better if they had Baltic states, but it, it's fun. I have, a, have to I do have ahead. tanks, but see, that's the thing. I can produce two out of Karelia as long as I hold it, and I can move tanks there. Yeah, it looks fine to me. I, I, I like so, everything. At least depended. And I have a few move infantry up there. Yeah, I have a couple infantry up there now. So yeah, I think, I think that'll be fine. All right. Uh, should I put a tank in Karelia or in Berlin? I guess Berlin. I like to have tanks in Berlin. Yeah, Berlin. They move. They move. Tanks are good in Karelia if you were trying to go set up like a Berlin attack G3 or like a Kakakas attack G3. You can do tanks in Karelia from there. But because we don't have wrecked Russia, we can't really guarantee that. All right, UK. All right, all right. Let's see.
Okay, I'll build I'll build a carrier and the, and the destroyer. So I have some chance against that uh, the submarines. See if this is gonna work. Hmm. It's a little bit risky. Let's see what uh, what the computer says about this. The computer says YOLO. Yeah. Two, three. I mean, yeah, I should win, but it is a little risky. Take France, though. Hmm. Wait, but maybe we don't, maybe I'm not going to worry about this at all. Um. Planes there, but I think that's fine. I'm fine with that. Very little I can attack. Um, I think that's that's probably all I attack. Just the forts, because everything else seems like not a not a good idea. Mm. 
<coughs> Play art. Let me leave everything else for later. Three plans. Russia is fine. And this is even. Where are these? Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot that I had, a, I had a tank here. Oh my god. Oh, that's such a. Uh, the tank was supposed to go to Morocco. Oh man. That is not what I wanted to do. Tank was supposed to take Morocco. I totally forgot. Ah, okay. Got your fighter in the schedule as well. Yeah, this can also go to the other Let's see. One bomber and three planes. Mm. It's probably okay like this. Okay, I think I moved everything that needs to be moved. Yeah, I'm supposed to get one more IPC from Morocco. Oh, damn. Okay. <clears throat> Go there. Oh. 
Okay. Alright. Stood up J3 in here. Bombers and infantry. <coughs> Start the expansion of the Asia. You didn't get another transport. Nah. That's alright. That's alright. Um, doing J3. India. Can I just convince you maybe? Let's let's just... That Germany is... I mean, not Germany. Uh, Russia is already kind of... hurting for units. I think it would be a better strategy. I'm just saying, I think it would be a better strategy for Japan to rush uh, Moscow. You don't want to go for um, India? Well. I mean, we won the game basically if we get India. Not really, and no. Not necessarily. Sorry. No. Well, since you didn't want to do the. Press Russia stack, but it's easy to one off of the VC stack. But J5, we get Hawaii. It's basically game over for them. I mean, if you want to try it, I, I, I think they're going to prevent that. Yeah, it forces them to do something, which is good, because that gives us tempo advantage. I know. I just think we could have a a round six, round seven, uh, one two punch on Moscow. That's not going to change. You. It's still up have... to you. You know, regardless, we have to go through India, whether we go through India directly or indirectly. Like, if we go up to Kaz, um, UK is going to be there to help support. They'll just right. follow us, you know? Because, like, if you count, you know, it takes us one, two spots to get to Kaz, and then it takes UK one, two. So they'll be able to defend it before we get there. Okay. Like we'll, we'll move to Sichuan, they'll go to Persia, and then we go to Kaz, and then they're able to hit back. So it's not like we have to go through them one way or another. It's not like you're avoiding them. I'm just looking at this. I probably won't do it. I was assume. I want to put my fighters there. I don't think I have enough. What were you trying to do there? I couldn't see. All I saw was yeah, I was, seven. I was trying to see if I could um, stack season 35 with um, fighters. Not good for me. All right, USA. All right, guys. What do you uh, want as my builds this time? Um, get two transporters. Fill those up. Well, you have um, you have basically um, one transport coming from nineteen, 
it yeah. can go to 11 yep. and it, it already has one guy so we can build an additional dude for it uh, and then you can probably build another full transport of infantry and then I don't know exactly how much money you have left over. Maybe well, got, right now I got tw uh, two transporters. I've got two infantry, two artillery, and I have twelve left over. Let me see. Uh, and build. I would build one less transport. Where's and okay. yeah, one less transport because you already have one coming from nineteen, uh, and one less man because you already have one extra. Man. Actually, actually, I would be, I would not build any artillery. Just strike the artillery completely, and build third men, and now build uh, aircraft carrier and a plane. That's what I would do. So the idea is that you have several aircraft carriers, so you can uh, yeah. defend several sea zones, yeah, and have uh, I like it. plane supporting you. That look good. So aircraft carrier, one transport, one fighter, three infantry. I think so. Yeah, yeah. that's what I would do. Beautiful. I like it. So you want me to take C, uh, go C zone thirteen? And... Yeah, I would. I would send everything there. Uh, I would send uh, basically one transport uh, to kill the. Gibraltar, dude. Right, so an army, uh, artillery. Yeah, and yeah, for example, yeah. Artillery and infantry. Okay. And and the uh, airplane can also help, I think. The cruiser, too, right? Yeah, exactly. And the rest, put the rest in, in Morocco. Yeah, I messed up. I should have taken Morocco for, for UK because UK needs the money actually more, but. It, it's okay. It's okay. It went this way now. That's fine. Um, I was AFK, so I didn't. Leave. Sorry about that. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's not not such a big deal. And uh, take one dude from uh, Mexico also. What do you want me to do in Kazakh? The the, the airplane one two three yeah airplane can hit the uh, Gibraltar also the one oh. eleven. Uh, in Kazakh, I, uh, let me see. I don't think we can hold. Uh, let me let me, let me check. Can we hold actually? Uh, Caucasus. Um, oh, actually, yeah, I think we can. He can attack with. He can attack with how many? He can attack with. Two, 15, uh, 18, we can attack with 18 and we can have um, 12, 13, 20, 24, 28, minus the guys that will take West Russia, so tw about 25. Yeah, we can actually hold it. So, uh, send. I mean, this is non combat because you cannot really attack anything there. Yeah, okay. I'll go if, ahead. You just, I'll complete Yeah, this. you can just put those guys in afterwards to, um, to offices. Okay. And the, uh, what about the fighter? fighter Sorry? Squad. Yeah, fighter, fighter also there. Yeah. Okay. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful. I wasn't sure if you were. Second.
rest of the navy to their team. Yeah. You can actually land one of the fighters. Let's see where can you can land. You can probably land it in uh, in West Africa. Oh, I see. Uh, let me, let me change. Yeah. Uh, you can move the, those to 12, actually, or um, I mean the battleship to 12, the transport is correct. Yeah. Destroyer to 55. And, uh, and the destroyer can also go to Europe, I think. It, it has nothing to do. Pacific right now. What about the uh, West Canada? Are you moving there? Yeah, moving moving east. I, I would I would have it. Oh, just be good. How's that? Yeah, looks good. Look good. Mm -hmm. Just good. Yeah. sort of help you need down in India, UK. Anything for me? Hello? You guys hear me? Yeah. Hello? Yeah, I can hear you. <laughs> Do you need me to help you anyway down in India? Um, let's see. Actually, actually, let me, let me, let me figure it out. Let me, I'll yeah. let you know when it's because yeah, this is, this is um, kind of important. Da, 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 da.
Yeah, I was gonna actually, <laughs> I was gonna suggest U.S. Uh, I I just I just forgot about India. <laughs> yeah, I feel like U.S. fighters should have been down there. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I just uh, I don't know why I didn't think about it, but uh, let's see. Um, I don't think it's looking good. Uh, I think India got blown. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Yes. And three. Let's do a little calculation. Mm. I think we blew it. Hold on a second. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think we can actually defend it. I have like ninety percent. It doesn't. With the yeah, yeah, it doesn't. No, I can, I can, I can get it down, down, but, but it's. Uh, yeah, no, it's still, yeah, it's still, it's still pretty high. So yeah, India is fine. <laughs> so, don't need any help. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Alright, so I think I'm going to buy these seven dudes, five dudes, two artillery, because that's all I can afford. Yeah, sounds good. Uh, I don't have a good hit on Ukraine. Probably not. Let's just yeah. shove everybody into West Russia here. Yeah, no, you can't. Um... Just, just attack it with some, like, I would say, one artillery, two, two infantry, and three planes. Just to basically kill those units there. See what happens. Yeah, I don't know. I don't feel good about it. Where are we are. <laughs> what happened? And send everything to Caucasus, uh, except one guy, Tark Angel, of course, from, uh, yeah. And I guess Nova? Yeah, yeah. And Kazaka, I stay or no? No. Send everything to Caucasus. Put some, uh, put some more artillery. Uh, um, yeah, no. We got. Oh, it's, it's good. It's good. It's fine. Yeah, they uh, they sneaked up on on India almost. So. <laughs> it's because we went heavy in Africa. Yeah. Oh right. Yeah, I, I mean, usually when I'm when I want to be really careful about India, I would send a couple of Russian dudes actually down. But it was a little bit uh, maybe tricky right now because Russia was yeah a little bit maybe in not such a good spot itself. So yeah, ah, it's fine. For a community <laughs> game, it's it's you Italy or not as Germany. You get to make that decision before you do your purchase. You don't want to give away troops for free. Huh? What are you talking about? You want to, um, before you, you finish your purchase, you want to see if you want to hold Italy or not. Because if you can't hold it, any troops you put in Italy is going to be traded. So you don't want to give away troops for free. See what I'm saying? Mm, yeah, no. <laughs> hold on. So, like, if you can't hold Italy, you don't yeah. want to put units in Italy. Because they're just you're giving them up for free, basically, because they're going to trade it. So you want to see if you can actually hold Italy or not. Like, if you can't 
if you can only build 12 units, then it doesn't really matter. But you got 13 built, so you want to consider if you can actually hold it. I think we can hold it if we send air, right? And then it's not going to take a lot of ground units to hold it. We just keep those four units chilling in Italy mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to send two to France from Berlin, or we can send one from Italy and one from Berlin. You can also send two from Berlin and then build mm -hmm. three more yeah. in Italy at the end of your turn. But you want to at least have four, five infantry on the ground at the end of your turn. And then he sent our fighters to Italy, and it should be pretty safe. That's yeah, that's my purchase, but um, okay. That's interesting. All right. So now West Russia, what can he put into West Russia? Twenty-five. Am I counting that right? Yeah, that's what I got. <laughs> fighters can come because they'll need be needed in Italy right you might need all of the fighters in Italy just depends on how many ground you're gonna leave behind if you have like seven ground with the ANA then yeah you, you won't need as many air but he has eight units that US can attack with and UK could try to hit it as well they could try to do a, a small tap, but it's really risky for UK to one two it Italy. I don't think it's worth the value. So it's not just US you have to prep for. Plus having air in Italy kind of helps dead zone the sea zones. Puts a lot of pressure on all the surrounding sea zones. Yeah, but then I have Makes nothing to trade. Me. Then I have nothing for trading. You can still trade with fresh Russia. And you have a bomber. It can go pretty far. But you can still trade with Russia in Italy. fighters I have a tank I can put there you don't have to trade Archangel like there's nothing like super important it kills the Archangel. unit it kills the unit yeah it's still not you know huge I'll say it's better for us to have an extra defender in Italy than to kill an extra defender of Russia Dude, uh, okay since you're going for India I I'm gonna go for Archangel yeah 
I mean, it's fine. You need to kill the unit. Do it. Burn. I'm just looking at how much I want to put in Italy. Like, I could attack Morocco. What if I attack Morocco with what I have in Algeria? What do you mean with Algeria? You mean like you use your your Yeah, you use these units to get rid of these units oh. and he can't he can't attack Italy with as many units. You can try, but it it's a little bit better just to catch show there because it forces allies to deal with it. I know that. I know I know but but well, it, if it's saves... but if you just run the man Yeah, like you can try to chip off a couple blocks off but units off, but it doesn't really do much unless you're really worried about Italy falling. Does yeah. that it's more units that I could send. It's more units I could send toward Mo Mo Moscow. Well, the the Let's units see. in Italy, you're gonna want to kind of stay in Italy. Like they're not Dude. ever gonna really move out. They're just defending it. They're not going towards Moscow, and if they do, it's gonna take them quite a few turns. But yeah, but if I take a couple of his units. He, he has less that he can attack Italy with, and I don't need to put as much in Italy. Yeah, and you can try these that, units. These units are dead really anyway. Good. They're dead anyway. Yeah, but they have value being on the board still because it forces allies to deal with it. It's it's kind of like checkers. But he'd or... rather take Italy than 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 Algeria. Yeah, he he definitely would. Yeah. But because we give him a hard battle for Italy, he's going to be, take the Algeria battle. Most likely. Whether it's with the UK or But America. then how does Germany stop the Soviet Union from pushing them back then? It looks like you're doing a fine job by you, you're be stacking your crane. Uh, I'm trying, I'm trying. What does it look just, like? What does you know, it look like? Let's, let me see Korea, what this looks like. You, Let's see what it looks like. If I was you... I would just use Karelia as the trading base because you get two infantry per turn and just every turn just send those two infantry to rest Russia and I will make your crane stack um, bigger. Instead of using your crane to trade, I'll use your crane to build up. First, since Russia has three planes, it's very easy for them to trade two territories. If I was able to take care of this, maybe. Let's... Hmm. Hmm. All right, all right, I guess since your vote is no, that's my deciding factor. What about season you, seven? You, what about season seven? Do you think, like, getting a couple of hits, try to get a couple of hits for those two subs, you think that's worth it? Yeah, you can, if you think. Or unless you think it's better to keep them alive. Well, I would send, um, the, no I would send the bomber with so. it. I would send the bomber with it. I mean, risking that's, that they—I that, I don't think they would get three hits, but that's definitely an interesting gap to go for. I don't know if it helps us too much, though. I'm just happy to build an extra destroyer, so I consider that a win. Yeah. Yeah, that is yeah. a win. All right. You want to go for it, or you can retreat them to like season four or five, because it's hard for UK to chase you. Like if you put one in five and one in four, 
it's hard to chase you because then they have two less defenders. If I do what? I'm sorry. If I... you in non combat, if you move your subs to four and five, yeah, it's hard for UK to chase them because then UK has weaker yeah. C zones. Yeah. That's... And four and five has no value for them. That was going to be the the obvious move. If I didn't <laughs> attack seven. Yeah. All right. I think this is good. I'm gonna lock this in. No, yeah, looks good to me. Got France clean. It always feels bad when you lose France when you're trying to trade it. No, you don't want to not get France. That's like devastating. I'll get back an Archangel. Arvork Pepper, yeah, I played Japan last game. Alright. Oh <sighs> he got two hitbacks. I was <laughs> like, why are there people that believe they actually defend better? But, I don't know, I'm just making a joke. No, I know, I know. But there's people that actually believe that. Is it true? Now, Berlin is perfectly safe, right? Nobody can get in Berlin. You just gotta decide if you wanna go through Baltics or Poland. I guess I could go to Baltic now. You don't have to send that many army. I guess you kinda do. I mean so you, you you can you see those three infantry? Um you can move those out and then build those three in Italy. Unless you wanna have more infantry in Italy. Like uh, you know what, I'll take one of them out. Because he can one two punch. I, I just want to have something extra there. You, it's hard for UK to one two punch because it, it's a lot of value. All right, I'll take two out. out, but I'm putting one in there. <laughs> just because I want another infantry in Poland. Uh, the bomber. No. I mean, I want the bomber in Karelia. Those fighters are good in Ukraine, right? Yeah, it should be. They def they they yeah. They're safe. I don't know if it's the best position, but. Well, it's 2 to 15. I can always send a Japanese air if it's if it's tight, looking tight. I don't I'm not worried about the defense of Ukraine. I think Ukraine is fine. I I just want them to be able to hit 15 and hit Moscow and Not that we're attacking 15, but I'd rather have all my air be able to hit it. Right. Yeah. It's a, well. I mean, if it's not the best position, where where would you say is? Is what I was asking. I like Italy position, <laughs> but they can't. Well, they don't reach no Italy. More. They don't reach Italy now. Yeah.
Because it's either there or Karelia. So, Ukraine it is. That looks good to me. Should I send this anti-aircraft? I can... They're not attacking Berlin. I can always move it back. And it gives me the option to put it, like, in Ukraine or send it forward. Alright. Tank there. In Italy. Two up there. Rest in Berlin. Alright, boys and girls. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what it can do. Reloading. Transports and let's see, maybe Oxford and train. Um, five or one, maybe like this. Trail I four infantry and three transports. How about that? What do you think? I mean, ah, it's maybe a little bit too many. Too many. Yeah, I, too it's many. usually yeah, dropping all four at once or like dropping the fourth all at one time. So, wait, you have two coming up, or you have three coming up? Yeah, yeah. I have, well, I have, I have three. Yeah, I have three. So I'm gonna build two more. is fine. The, the, basically, the more the better. <laughs> but uh, let's see. I, I just don't know what else to build here, really. <laughs> I guess I could... Um, let's build another artillery, maybe. Four infantry. Yeah, 
I guess I could do like this. It's probably... Oh wait, that's too much because I don't want to build in India. I'm um, building in India, so maybe just build a fire bomber or something. Something, something. Hmm. Be bomber. Be bomber. Four infantry. I want a tank left over. It's probably gonna be fine like this. Yeah. Bombers are good, right? Yeah, it's good. Yeah. <laughs> I like to get one when you got the second to do it. What? Sorry? Oh, I like to get one when you have a chance to get it. Yeah, why not? Yeah, good moment. Good moment that now that we don't care about India anymore. Yeah. Pretty much. That's usually when it happens. Yeah, exactly. So you want to take India? Okay, hot light bomber. <laughs> I'm, I'm so pissed off that I didn't put my tank here. It should be, would be so good right now. <laughs> but it's not better. Okay, what can I do? What can I do? Yeah, I think we went a little too hard into Africa and forgot that you were on your own in India. Well, yeah, no, it's it's, it's my fault, of course, but I, it's all right. We'll, we'll be fine. India is not that important. I mean, it's... It would be nice to keep it for a few few more turns, of course, but you know, I think I'm going to be fine. It's just unfortunate it's on schedule for Japan. Yeah. Let's see. So then we can go there. Hmm. I think we have any other attacks to what do you think? Um, I mean I can't burn us too much, I can't attack that. No, too much there. We throw up too many guys. Wait, what are you doing with this tank in Africa? Are you just leaving it? No, it's just gonna go east. Alright. That's fine. Don't need it. Um since we already dropped it out, it's fine. What about yeah, the bomb bomber in though. India? Bomber in India. Can't really hit anything. Oh yeah, actually, actually, hey, it can help out here. Yeah, that's uh, that's a good point. Yeah. Yeah. I guess you could bomb. Right Why not? No, no, no need. I mean, yeah, eventually, but I think this is probably better right now to just yeah. help out there. Yeah. Just get everything out of there. <clears throat> no. Okay. Going on. And so, okay, this one. Hits maybe, maybe, no, not really. Okay. Now we fine. <clears throat> oh, 
okay, so bomber, bringing a bomber was a good, <laughs> that was a good plan. So uh, I'm uh, I'm gonna need US to take Norway with one guy, or actually can send two guys there even um, with a with transport. Um, let's see. I'm aware of some. I hope so. Yeah. Let's say I did. Yeah, feeling a little bit sad about India, but. Japan. Yes, we get one well, India. We I didn't expect them to just hand you India. I, I would, because personally, I would have, I would have made a move to defend it at least one more round. But okay, I wasn't expecting that result, so that I, okay, I take back, I take back what I said about going for India. I, I thought they were going to hold it for two more rounds. Like I would have put Soviet units in there to hold it. That's what I was thinking they would do. I guess they decided that wasn't the best move for them. I'm just some attack. Go and start my colonism on the Allens. Yeah, that's cool. They didn't do a destroyer block, which was made me most sad. I was hoping they would have done a destroyer yeah, block. Um, do you, yeah, I was going to say, take it from 38. I thought you were going to 46. That's cool. Yeah, I probably would just ignore the Africa since they got the med going. I don't know. Get, if Japan could start picking off Africa, that's that's a problem for them. Hold, hold on, Archer. Don't, don't touch my keyboard, kiddo. <laughs> let, me, let me now you can play with it. I turned it off. Okay, now you can play with the keyboard. Bringing in the, the secret yeah. weapon. Yeah, yeah. My <laughs> three year old, my my three year old's gonna come and <laughs> defeat you all. No, I can't change the channel, kiddo. This I'm I'm playing the game here. They got a sub trying to pick off my transport. 
Alpha. Track, Snoopy. Hold on, okay, I'll be right back. Super sub sneak attack. Can't trick me. What do I want to I don't know if Ray was going to be safe this round. It looks pretty, pretty dicey. What that? What's that? Corellia? I don't know if it's. I guess it'll be safe. Corellia? Um, I mean, I, I, I go before he can hit it, really. Yeah, I'm just looking at the. He has a lot of transports for, but he doesn't have that many. I mean, if you yeah, could start getting bombers into Corellia, I'll I'll stack up Corellia, and you can, you know, I'll I'll keep it safe if it's a place for your bombers. Yeah, I just want to see if there's a place I want net too. That'll start to be I a problem for him. But I mean, you know, let's make sure that it's going to be safe, right? It looks like it is. Worst case, we can give up Ukraine and some tanks there. Okay. That's true. Yeah, that's true. I don't think it would come to that. Especially since the US is not in range. If the US was in range, I would I would definitely not do that. Double check on everything. I don't think I have to decide if I want to destroy her on the north or south side. I think south side's actually better. Which destroyer? I'm sorry. I only have one destroyer, and he has two subs. One US and one UK. Yeah. I was just deciding where I wanted that. Where's this US sub? Um, it's already up there, hiding in 64. 64, okay. Exactly. That looks good to me. Happy purchase. Got an extra transport. All right, what do you guys think of the U.S.? Resign. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Have a baby no. and conceive. <laughs> so, um, so now you gotta. Let me see if we can go to fifteen. I think we should be able to. He has. Oh, he has six. One, two, three. Yeah, you can. You can. You can go to sixteen uh, with a fleet and take uh, South Europe. One guy, mm, and you can send uh, one transport to the, to Norway. Sixteen um, or fifteen? Yeah. So 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 basically, one transport goes there, one transport goes to Norway, one to uh, fifteen. I mean, sorry, fifteen to to uh, to South. Uh, so you have to. So you have basically two transports going back to the U.S. Uh, you have one guy coming from East Canada, so you need to build three more guys for these transports. Uh, and then you can build another transport, perhaps, with two guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, am I taking the Navy to uh, 15 or just one transport? No, no, Navy, 15, yeah. You can you can take Navy to 15 as well. Um, yeah, I was, I was just counting transports, how many you need, basically, so... Um, and you can... and build, build uh, two dudes for the, for the new transport as well. That gives me number 18. 18, and then you can... Let's see, you have... Uh, 
Oh. I mean, you could technically build another transport, bring even more units, and build maybe transport artillery infantry or something like that. Six two, yeah. And two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's um, that's. I think that's that's pretty good. What do you want up in Norway? The tank and the and the infantry. Uh, yeah, you can. Yeah, you can do that. You can do that. Just one, just one is enough. Just the one. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, actually, oh, you know, actually, hmm, I just thought about, thought of another idea, what to do. Uh, take. Uh, take, for instance, take infantry and artillery and hit Italy, uh, just to kill his A gun there. And, and battleship and cruiser. Oh, no, never mind. Uh, no, no, no. You can't reach it. Can't do it. That. Yeah, I think. Let me see. Oh, you can. Hmm. I'm thinking whether it's a good idea or not. Um, Russia can. I'm just looking at where Russia can use its planes. Um, it's. It's probably better to save this, um, save the dudes in that you have right now in Caucasus and not, not use them yet. Okay. Yeah, that looks good. Are you good with this? I think so. Yeah, I don't. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Bomber. Uh, hit Berlin. Str strategic bombardment. Yeah. Because you can you can raise the bomber because the it doesn't have any any specific purpose right now. Yeah. All right. Good with that. Yeah. For sure. Let's go. <clears throat> Open the doors, boys. <laughs> Did some, did some damage to German. Good. Very well. Oh, you could have taken West Russia, I guess. I was thinking about it, but we decided not to. I think it's better to take it over with uh, Russia in this situation. I was going to. I was thinking maybe strafe it, but with one and. Well, well, the thing is. The thing is that your your U.S. units there in Russia are very, very valuable. You don't want to just waste them, basically. Yeah, I, I totally agree. Um, it's better to use them if you have more planes there, basically. Yeah. Uh, you can send the bomber not to England, but you can send it also, I think, Caucasus. to... Yeah, yeah, you can send it to Caucasus, I think. I think it's should be safe, right? I think so. Yeah. We're good there? Okay. Yeah. 
He has a better position there, basically. He transforms back, carrier of battleship up. Uh, fleet to 15, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, you go. Okay, good. I think good. I got them all there, right? Uh, and one more fighter yeah. to 15. Yeah. You, you actually, uh, the first turn, what you missed was that the fighter that you had in, I think you had a fighter in West, Western US. It, it could have landed in, in 13. That, that was a, that was a point why you, why you sent one fighter to Africa because you had three fighters. Just, just for your information from West US, you can, you can land in 13. But it's it's fine. It's fine right now. You, you didn't see if, if, for example, if you needed to use it, uh, yeah, this I turn it would be better here. Yeah, but, I just uh, had it on the carrier instead. Right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's I fine. get that. Good. Thank you. What about uh, no just problem. keep the uh, infantry in Mor everything in Morocco? Yeah, yeah. That's what I would do. And we okay and see some zip. And then bring the bring the Eastern Canada gun. Yes. Thanks. Uh, destroyer 19, or to 18, excuse me. Do you like him there, or do you want me to? Uh, wait. Um, leave the destroyer in the Pacific. Oh, this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's fine. 18 is fine. How's everything else look? Did we good? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Beautiful. Dudes. You all good with seven dudes? Um, no, I would, say, I, would, I would still bounce. What, what's uh, how much? Do you need to get three and three or seven dudes. Three guys, three artillery mm -hmm. or seven. Uh, yeah, I think in, in this case, three, three is fine because you have lots of infantry already. I was thinking two and a fighter to West Russia, but maybe the two go from Col Um Let's see. Yeah, I guess yeah, two or two because you wanna take it, right? That's yeah. true. Yeah. And then I think we can send him from caucus because we could always refill it from Moscow, but just in case we more fun. In this situation, well, you need one guy from Moscow needs to go for to Archangel, but other than that, yeah, you can, it doesn't matter really. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, this is the only attack we have, I think. Doors are closing, y'all. Need to see some boots on the ground over there. <laughs> All right, so we got one dude to arc. Do we want to bring everyone in Novo down? Everyone in Nova split? <laughs> no, no, no. Bring it, bring it to Moscow. Yeah. This and then chilling in Kaka. Yeah. yeah, it's fine. Well, yeah. hold on. It's gonna have an attack with a tank and five fighters. Could to where? What? What do you mean? To Moscow. Oh, you mean? Oh. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So he has. 
He has four fighters. Oh, yeah, and the bombers also. Yeah, okay, let's let's block that. <laughs> let's block that. Maybe put put one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We do we, a little we, this, we, and uh, hey, yeah. Yeah. Actually, wait, 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 wait. Uh, UK goes. Next. Yeah, you can you can still go there. Yeah, you can still go there. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I mean UK UK goes first, but that's fine. You can yeah, you can still put it there. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> Should I just put all four your artillery here, or all three artillery there? He, yes, yes. You sneaky tank. Almost got you. <laughs> I was like, hold on a second. There's four people here. Well, yeah, good thing anything. you noticed. I was like, we can't put anything in caucus if we leave that gap open. <laughs> we have to put everything. Sure. I'm paying attention. We could still hold Italy, right? He's got eight units, but he can't. He can't even transport all of them, and he wants this. Yeah. Look, it looks fine. I'll just keep. Six, I'll just seven, keep eight, back in nine, Italy. Ten. Use Italy to upgrade France. And well, I, I'm just saying. I, I only need to put. I don't need to put. Momentum. Don't need to I'll put too much more like there. I'll be back probably in like 15 minutes. I mean, I'll just use Italy as a trading hub. You know, that way you don't lose momentum going, um, east. You know what I mean? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Repair two and get two more. Thirteen infantry. Well, now you can consider attacking season six. That's pretty. We don't have a lot of stuff, though, to attack it. Two subs and a, a bomber. In fact, it's about the same as last time. Yeah. But this time there's a transport there. Yeah. I don't know if it holds much more merit. Fifteen is he's got that pretty safe. Definitely want France. Oh we gotta use these. Hold on, whoa. Use two from Italy. Yeah, looks good. I'll try one there. One there. Like I'm not You can also ignore um, so ignore Northwestern Europe if you're I too thin. I could, I could. Let's let's see what happens here. Send the bomber to France, and then you're gonna you're probably gonna take Archangel and shit, right? So I'll just we'll trade. See. I'll trade this one. <clears throat> yeah, I think that's my move. I don't think I go for any sea zones. Alright. One thing I would do different is for like one v one fights. I like to have a bomber with the solo infantry instead of the fighter. It has in the fighter with the two infantry. It's a little bit more consistent, but it's okay for now, especially since it's France. No, the bomber's going to France. Yeah. Yeah, I just want to make sure I get that hit in France. The 1v1s are kind of, you know, they're bonuses. I'm thinking about my stack in Ukraine. Are we keeping it there? Or do we move it? Mm -hmm. I guess we can wait till after combat to decide. It's not going to change much. Alright. We'll move. The 
Everybody missed. missed. Everybody missed. That's pretty good. Two units is better than one. That's why we sent three. We could always put one more there. We're a trip or better. Units are starting to get tight. Units are starting to get tight, so I'm trying to use the minimal amount of units. Yeah, we'll find. Allies are not bad. Shaking in their boots, especially since we took India. See, that's scared. See, that's that's pretty good too that we got both those yep. one for v ones. They're, they're making mistakes. They they almost sent a tank in to Moscow. <laughs> yeah, well, that's another thing you could have done. You could have sent the bomber to can open, and that would have been a pretty good move to do with the bomber. Well, the UK, UK, UK I, well, I guess, yeah, Novo, I no, guess Novo I could have done. UK, UK, no, they can only block it with a fighter, but that still would have been value. Yeah, they could block guess it with a fighter, that. yeah, yeah, so. They just sent the bomber to um, Novo Brosk, or a fighter, too. But... Alright, okay, so now, Ukraine, do we want to stay in Ukraine? I mean, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 20. I got exactly 25 there, and he can hit it with 25 things. I mean, it's not a question of can we defend Ukraine, the question is do we want to defend Ukraine? Right. Because I'm thinking of maybe um, moving, move, uh, maybe moving the... 16, I'm thinking yeah, of maybe 19. moving... You can send um, about 20 into Russia, Russia, too, as well, if you want. That could be interesting. I don't know if it's good. But that would be interesting uh, to do. So he can come in there Even with 25 there. things? That I think that's... Yeah, that just might be too much. Yeah, but, but I could send you fighters. I could send you five fighters. You could. So we can easily defend. So, the, yeah, okay. Yeah. So, the, well, I can't put my fighters there, though. No, you can't, but you can put your fighters in Karelia and Italy, which is better. I guess I can send two more there. Okay. Uh, well, they can't go to Italy, but... The ones that can go to Italy, go to Italy. Yeah. The, the ones that can't go the to The ones that, that can go to Italy are the ones that were already there. Yeah. These three will go to Karelia. These infantry. Yeah. I like it. And then I'll put these in here. Well, or just the AA gun. Yeah. As long as you get 20 units in there, you know, I, I can put, make it 25 if you have 20 units in there. So you don't gotta put everything in there. Well, 20, would, as long 26, as 26 is better. You might... Yeah, you might want to keep the AA gun in, in Karelia, because UK has a lot of air that can hit it. Mm. But yeah, keep the Poland stack into your crane. Like the two infantry and one AA gun, you want that in your crane. Because it makes it very hard for um, him to attack it, because he doesn't want to trade with just ground units, because we have a big stack on his door. He wants to trade it with air, so having that alien gun there mm. makes it very awkward for Russia. But not that awkward. It, it makes it, yeah, they don't, trust me, it does make it very awkward because Japan's going to be surrounding them. Yeah, they have Germany right outside the front door, so they can't defend two places. They can't defend Kakaka's and Moscow. They have to pick one. And so it's, 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 um, yeah. They'll be forced to trade it with air if they want to go for it. All right, but then the AA gun staying. The AA gun staying in West Russia, though. 
Yeah, but you also gotta look at UK. UK has how many air that can attack Corellia? They have like one, two, three, four, send nothing else into Corellia. Because he has what, like five ground units? Five. And then he has like seven plane. So he has like 12 that can attack Corellia on right after you're done. And you only have what? Eight guys that defend it with my then, three bombers? Well, then we can't do West Russia. No, you, you can. You just can't put everything, you know. And like if you put like your one or two tanks into. So you got a tank in Berlin, right? So you can send that tank to Corellia. You get you get a tank or two you can put into Karelia from Ukraine, and Japan can defend it. No, I can see, send like no, we're, we're not, no, because then we're pulling too much off of no, no, no. I'm not. I I'm, can send like eight units on West Russia. There's no reason for us to make that kind of a risk, man. What do you uh, mean risk? Leaving West Russia vulnerable like that. It's just not. <laughs> I don't know. That's. Well, anyways, you you're gonna want to put units in Karelia. I'm putting everything I can in Karelia. You keep. <laughs> I'm. I'm sorry, dude. You keep telling me that, but I'm putting everything I can in there. All right. So like like we if if he can bring that much into Karelia, we can't hold it unless I put tanks in there, and if I put tanks in there, then I can't hold West Russia, is what I'm saying. So I, I wanted to just move my whole stack to Karelia, was what I was trying to say in the, the, you know, before. Something like that. Now he can't get Karelia, and you can put your bombers there. And those tanks can still get back to Berlin, they can still get back to Ukraine. Yeah. Now you have to consider if you want to stay on your crane or if you want to move off and move off the ground. No, I want to... I want to move up here. And we could still put the two there with the AA gun if you want. Yeah, that's good. Italy looks protected. Korea looks protected. And Berlin looks there. good. So that's good. Because he still has to worry about now with all the tanks there, he still has to worry about uh, trading Archangel every round. Looks 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 safe to me. Um. Oh my God, we're still in Germany. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Oh no, it's funny. I was like rushing to get back. I, was, like, I got a lot to consider. <laughs> yeah, so lucky. Yeah. The five units in that. Berlin. What do you what do you think? Should I move them? To Baltic or in Berlin, yeah, um, really you can start on supply if you want. You can try to build a supply line. So one in Baltic and then two or four in, you know, like Poland, and you build a supply through Poland to. Well, if Korea, I put one in Baltic, Poland. he's probably gonna just kill it, right? Yeah. So you can just send them to Poland instead. That's yeah, what I mean. Like yeah. You build a supply. Yeah. Yeah. We'll just... Yeah. I don't like to give the units for free, but. But I'm gonna, I'll, I'll leave a couple of them. Like, like, we gotta remember, works. we gotta remember too, I can only put how many out of Berlin? I can only put eight out of Berlin. Mm. So what can he hit Berlin with? Um, USA and UK. Yeah, we need to defend Berlin. Yeah, they can catch us in a in a pickle yeah. because they can two, send a lot to six, Berlin on U.S. turns. Six, yeah, maybe. You don't have to send up. You don't have to start up the supply line since you got eleven units right outside the door of K. I, I do want like. Okay. I do want like. Two units. Yeah. But since you get eleven, you know, right outside, it's not like those units really do anything to just make Berlin weaker. You get a, a fighter in there.
what they do is they give... Well, I guess there's 11 units up in Bellow, but... Yep. I don't I don't want Eastern Europe to be completely empty. I guess, I guess, I guess it's alright for now. But, well, if not, since you got 11... No, I guess it's alright for now. Tough. Yeah, it's alright for now. I'm still gonna put that fighter in Berlin. Sure. Leave that tank there, too. Looks fine to me. All right. Everything I can in there. There and there. All right. Let's see it, my friends. There you go, princess. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> I was just rushing back. I was like, oh my god, it might be my turn. I know, I took a long <laughs> time that turn. Okay, UK. I gotta do some thinking now.
Uh, what's going on, guys? We still here? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just thinking of purchase. Oh, I didn't hear. I didn't hear any chatter. I thought. Yeah, we, we were not chatting, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. You don't, you're not required, you're not required to chatter. I just want to make sure that, uh, you know, I didn't lose everybody. That's yeah, all. of course. <laughs> After all, you have a channel and people are starting to worry, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I understand. Uh, all right. I think I'm going to buy this. My carrier fighter from ground units. Let's try that. And let's take some. Let's see, France. Let's see, France. Nothing in Corelli. Uh, princess, did you get? Did you see how you get? Um, did you see how never brisk doesn't block the blitz? From... What? Noble brisk. What about it? Um, Germany has air that could snipe it. That will open it up. Not not anymore. Germany has already moved. <laughs> yeah. No, the, the thing is, the thing is that there is there is no danger of that because UK has units there and UK is going after Germany. So. Yeah. They can, Okay, so I'm, yeah, I'm hitting all these zones here, let's see if, oh, I actually want to transport too many, interesting. Yeah, you bought your fifth last time. Yeah, yeah, no, no, it's, it's good to have many transports, it's just that they, they didn't give me enough units to, to use it on. <laughs> they were, they were a little stingy with the units, you know, that's the problem. So, 
don't know. Am I missing anything that I should attempt? I'm meeting friends to put to. Okay, I'll, I'll check what is um everything is strong, I'm sure. Strong. So anything yeah, okay. No, I think it's like it's good. I'm gonna put two carriers in five. Hold on, hold so on. I sent uh I sent a destroyer and two carriers. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. I wanna know. Is is it horrible or is it okay? Oh you you checking what? <laughs> Something. India. Some secret thing, nothing <laughs> okay. Do it. Forty percent. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna go for forty percent. That's for sure. But uh, if you do land unit dice last, oh, well, it's fifty-three. If, if it's anything less than eighty-five, and I'm not gonna take it, so <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's fifty-three percent. It would prevent. Yeah, it. no, it's it's, 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 it's fine. It's fine. I had to check it though. I had to check it because you had like good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not we're, we're not gambling here, you know. <laughs> I don't know. We're in a pretty. Yeah, I feel like our position's a little weird. I mean, we might be able to push the front lines to rest Russia next turn, which would be nice. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Okay. Anyway, I'll I'll go with this. I think. I, yeah, I, yeah. I think you're there's good. There's nothing nothing better to do. So. So, let's see. Oh no! Oh, never mind. That's the bomber. Take that. Finally getting rid of that sub. Yeah. <laughs> I do have one more though. Uh I think. Are you holding Persia another round here? I I'll, I'll think about it a little bit. Um, let's see. Okay, so we check the numbers. Okay, let me see. Mm. Oh yeah, they have they have lots of planes. Let's see. Yeah, it's like six sure planes. Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll get them. Okay. Yeah, I was just hoping you could so that tank could uh, escape next turn, but. 
get stuck there. Let's see, yes, there. Okay, just a sec. Let me let me let me check this real quick. Yes. I'm just thinking how to how to lay my fleet here. Um okay. See what I'm doing. I've been one play.
Yeah, sorry, it takes a little, a little while to sort of figure out how to how to leave my units here, but I think this is probably should be probably okay. Yeah, I think I'll even like this. Nothing else I can do. Nothing else I can do that I can see. Okay. All right. Maybe screwed something up, but hopefully not. Hopefully not too much. All right. Ooh. There's a um, infantry. That should be good. You still not going with the complex? Well, um, we could consider a complex, but since it's turn four, I think it's better for us to do bomber in this position. Oh, I had a artillery though. Zealand. I think my bomber can reach that New Zealand, right? Yeah. Well, that's New Zealand, but just I knew what you meant. I'm just <laughs> just reminding you. Mm -hmm. Season mm -hmm. 40 is New Zealand. I, I think yeah. Austra Australians would be very pissed off. Yeah, they would. <laughs> or maybe the New Zealanders would be even more pissed off. I don't know. <laughs> I think it was considered an attack in Kazakh, but I figured not. If, he, if it would have just been pure UK troops, I probably would have done it. Well, I mean, if you think it could be profitable... It, it is, but I have to send all the, my planes there. Mm -hmm. it, it, not risky, I wouldn't say, but... I don't know if I want to go for it. It would look something like this if I did it. And he's got seven, eight, nine, ten. You could lose an aircraft, but I don't think it's that big of a deal if you lose an aircraft. 
Uh, basically, I mean, you could lose package. three. You could lose three aircraft, technically, but, uh... Yeah, the only... The only... Yeah, I'm 50-50 on it. I know, the only reservation I have is the anti-aircraft gun, but I, I don't know. I kind of like the idea of killing off a bunch of his infantry. The only reason I don't like it is because I like my bomber going to Australia, but... It's not a huge deal. Doesn't change much. I think I just have to be a little bit more patient and send everything to um, Australia and not go to New Zealand. Let me see, what does that battle look like? What does... What the Australia? It's I mean Yeah, um, what is it about the calculate I say? Does it sound likely? Favorable. Alright, I guess I'll leave it. Alright, I guess we'll go for it. Be a little frisky. Yeah, I think that I, I actually think that'll work out. I was afraid they were gonna take this hit. Yeah, I think any profit you can get on them right now is good profit. Especially since it's UK. I like doing that. Well, it's all they have left, and that's why um, also taking uh, Africa, even just pieces of it, it kind of suffocates them. But Australia and New Zealand nice. are, take money from them too, so... But the nice thing about the islands is those are like permanent things they lose. All right, so you lost your infantry. You right. can get out of there now. You can. Yeah, you can also go again. <laughs> nah, I wouldn't. Oh, I wouldn't. I, I mean, you can, you can if you want, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't. <laughs> I would. I would take the profit and run. You got the AA gun. You got five of their mm -hmm. infantry. That's cool. Yeah, I'd sacrifice a plane though, but I also to get rid of. It's up to you. Go. If, I'm, I'm not going to stop you. This, this is not an attack that I'm okay. against. I just I would be more conservative myself. But you you go for it. It's if you want. I think I'd do it since I'm scared of their counterattack on okay. the planes. UK has a lot of air. I was hoping they only get two hits, but they got three. It's all right. It's fine. It's all right. You still come out on top? Yeah, still a profit. That went better than I was hoping. I think I have to add one fighter to there. Yeah, like that. What, to, uh, Szechuan? Yeah. Now, make sure I'm gonna be able to hold Karelia, right? I should be able to hold Karelia, right? Well, you got 11 guys there coming in. If you, if you can't hold that, just don't assume they just don't assume they are all going in they can all go into Karelia though. Don't don't assume that. Only assume that a few of them can get there. I'm not saying that's what will happen, but just, you know. Underestimate it, you know what I mean? I'm gonna assume they're gonna be there. I'm gonna be very sad if they don't. <laughs> I'm just don't know if I wanna um, stay in India, walk around it. Yeah, because I might end up sending one or two of them to Ukraine or something. Don't, don't forget that. I might have to take Ukraine. I guess I'll just sit on it. I mean, we, we, I think we should be able to hold it, right? I don't, I don't think it's going to be a problem. Yeah. 
I was talking about India. If I was gonna move them or not. Oh, India. I'll just sit on it. Yeah. Well, why not? I mean, he could strafe it, but that's not a very good attack for him. Well, that would be a good attack for him. Uh, it's... There, we, we don't really have any threat. No, but he needs US, to. The, but then, take... but then he needs yeah, to. He... Then he probably has to pull off a of caucuses. I mean, it's too late now. It, it doesn't matter. It's a move point. He, he won't be able to because U.S. would be able to um, bail him out really easy. At least we got Alaska for free. What are you guys thinking? For the US? I'm gonna be doomed. Did you say doomed? doomed. <laughs> I said doomed. No, we're fine. We're fine. I, we can't push the line forward this turn without those. Uh, yeah. Thing that I one thing that I forgot to tell you last turn was to the infantry always move east like the, the ones in Morocco don't 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 just stand there just okay. keep moving okay. because it's it's uh, good to have this. Uh, basically you got to check how many transports you're gonna need this turn uh, you cannot take Italy so you can again take South Europe and you have a transport here ready so those two out of those two one is gonna one needs to go to take northwest uh one dude um six though but you can you can build for both of those transports because once it goes to eight then next turn it can go to ten to pick up so basically you need to build it this turn for for this one as well and for the other transport that which goes back so you need to build four dudes for these two transports and and then build uh, another carrier and a plane because we need what about Alaska? to do things, I would say. Wait, does he need another carrier and plane right now? Where is it going to go? Well. I mean, I mean, oh wait, wait, actually don't build, because you, you need to build something in West, uh, in West Russia. Well, the plane you can build in West Russia. I mean West Russia, West, West USA. Um, but you can, all, you need also, you also need to build uh, a couple guys there. Yeah. So, so let's see. Yeah, no, no carrier this turn. Let's let's not build a carrier this turn. Let's build a. Uh... Still want the fighter then, right? Yeah. So I got a fighter and. Four yeah, fighter is fine. And you can build. Uh... A Twenty-one. Minutes. Yeah, you can build uh, one more transport or two dudes. Left. You need some. You, uh, maybe get like a tank for West Russia and another guy. Like you, or like no, Western. No, 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 no. And no need for tank. Tank is a little bit inefficient. Let's just just build like a another infantry and artillery. I think that should be enough to defend it. I think a fighter and two infantry against two battleship and two infantry. Uh, fighter, infantry, artillery, and a gun you have there, so we can we can just check real quick. Uh, I think it should be fine. Oh, thank you. Good with that. So we guy? can go. Want me to upgrade one of my infantry to an artillery? Um, I guess you can. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Just forget this. Just. just... So we said we did. 
All right. You guys good with that? Fighter. Transport. Yeah. Six infantry, two artillery. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Sounds good. No. I'm there to support you guys. So. <clears throat> Uh, one one thing, what I actually forgot about it. Uh, I guess you can do it next turn. Build a, uh, build a factor in Norway. But you, you yeah, can do it I next was, turn. I was looking at that, but uh, maybe now is not quite the time. I, I don't know. Yeah, you can. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Just one guy for you. Uh, you can, uh, yeah. That's that's. Uh, let's see, I'm taking you to the planes. Yeah, that's good. I'll bring the. Wait, let me think how to do this. Uh, you need to place something in eight, uh, like uh, maybe, maybe the carrier. Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably carriers enough. Let me, let me let me check this. Um, he's got three bombs. No, no, he's he's got he's got the Germany got bomber and three fighters. Do you want my transporter to drop off from eight or from six? Uh, from, well, well, from six here you take your transport. Basic. Oh wait, you can. Oh yeah, I forgot about it. That you can actually could actually could have used the guy in Norway, but it doesn't. I can still do use the guy in Norway if you'd like. Yeah, you actually can. Yeah, let's let's do that. That's probably better. Yeah, yeah. Take the guy from Norway to attack them. This. And you want me to? Put it, put it in eight. Put it in eight. Transporter in eight. Yeah. In the tank. Like that. Yeah. That's yeah, good. and then. Uh, I'm just thinking what you what you need uh, what you need to bring here. Uh, just a sec. Um, yeah, it's actually fine. Like this. Ah, oh, okay. So so attack the attack the dude in. Uh, yeah, I think it's good to attack the dude in uh, in Persia also. Just one infantry. Uh, yeah, bomber there, and then Persia one infant and two. And okay, yeah, I guess you. Have Do you want me one. to bring that extra fighter from the carrier? Or no? uh, I'd say one, two, three, four. Oh yeah, actually you can. Yes, yes, do that. Yeah. Wait, but it's gonna be two. No, it's gonna be fine. Yeah, you can bring one from carrier to Persia. Yeah. That works. Mm -hmm. And the other one still goes to South Europe. So I you want that. my? Uh, what are you gonna want in eight? You want my battleship or my? Uh, the carrier with two planes uh, needs to go to eight. Battleship stays in thirteen. Okay. Is there anything else? Can move my mm -hmm. sub Where should I put my sub? You you can put your sub in fifty six. Or wait, let me see. Put it in. Yeah, actually, might as well put it in fifty six. Or maybe. Yeah, no, fifty six. Fine. Yeah, put it in fifty six. <coughs> <coughs> Good with that? I think so. Hopefully, I didn't miss anything important. Yeah, thanks. Um, okay, I'll go with this. Yeah.
Yeah, I think I think we're still fine. I mean, I mean, obviously, there's always a chance that that those guys are better than us and they beat us. Yeah, but I think we have a we have a pretty good chunk still. <laughs> so get my bomber this time. That sucks. Oh, they didn't. Oh fuck. <laughs> okay, bad luck. Well, happens. Better mine than yours. Well, I, I lost mine one and mine two, so. <laughs> oh, did you? We both lost the bomb there. <laughs> and then you play a game where the the, the other guy is bombing you like every oh. turn and nothing happens to it, you know? That's sure. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Yeah. Or like the first bombing raid of the day, you just like lose the bomber. Get the 1 6 or the 6 1. Ugh, so That's ugly. what I usually get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You start seeing fat stacks dropped in Europe here. I feel like. Well, I want to have that art, one of the that artillery. Ah, no, never mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's fine. Oh, uh, yeah. No, it's fine. What's that? Can take. Uh, sorry. What did you want to do? Um, I was thinking. Well, I've got that artillery in Gibraltar, right? Maybe I can just leave. I could. Leave. Oh, this one. No, 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 don't worry about it right now. You, you're gonna well, let it that, sit there now. Because you, you can you can maybe use it one one day against Italy or something. Right. So on, can my, on my transport coming over from from eleven, should I maybe leave a would you leave a artillery? No. No, no. Bring it bring it all bring it all to bring the artillery yeah. all. Because we're building more, you're building two more, so it's fine. But move the move the carrier, so you don't forget. Yeah. On the planes. Okay. Is that it? Uh, let's see. Okay, so we have two fighters here. Let me just check real quick. I think. I think so. Yeah. I think yeah, I think it's. I think it's all good. Just to move my infantry up this time. Sorry about that. Sorry. Yes. No problem. No problem. <laughs> I, I just didn't myself. No, I, didn't I, didn't I, I was thinking about that. I was like, oh, yeah, I thought, um, I don't know what I was thinking. Yeah. Well, well, you. It's it's just a principle that U.S. Yeah. infantry always just Absolutely. needs to move. Yeah. Lesson learned for sure. That's that's yeah, no I problem. The, I appreciate the feedback. Hold on. No problem. Hundred percent. I'm just I'm just basically telling you how I would do things. Yeah, that's all. Well, you know what? It's you know I respect. You know you can always. Uh, everything's an opportunity for a learning experience. So anything to better my game, I'd rather, you know, you always want to game with guys better than yourself. So that's kind of how I look at it. So all you guys, I learn, you know, I'm learning from all you guys. So much appreciated. Man. So I think I'm good, man. What do you guys think? You good? I think so, yeah. Right. yeah. So I'll put the fighter. Put the fighter... Uh, you can put one artillery and two infantry even there, I think, in West, because yeah, you're going to have... Yeah, but I, I, you know, I'm always better safe than sorry. You might get lucky, man. Well, well, you, you, you put one artillery and five... Wait, one artillery and five infantry to go 
no, a four in front, yeah. One and four go to, yeah, and, and the transport. So that's perfect, perfect, just went. I mean, even on West Coast, two two uh, ground units would have been fine, but uh, okay. it's up to you. but since we have an extra, then we just uh, we just put the extra there. A bit. So two infantry and one artillery and ten, or just one and one and. Uh, yeah, one artillery and two infantry and ten. Okay, beautiful. Okay. Yeah. So the artillery can always step back too to central and be picked up by a new transport. Yeah. Extra. Oops, yeah, I, did, they... I did forget my destroyer. That sucks. Oh well. What, what do you mean? Oh, you forgot to move it. Yeah, okay, okay. Well, yeah, I didn't, to be honest, I didn't notice it. Even it was, it was sort of okay. hidden yeah, there. <laughs> that, I got so okay. excited. Well, actually, the destroyer there might not be horrible. No, no, it is horrible. <laughs> Sorry, no, it is horrible. There's, there's, this, there's this 40 yeah. transport that has its eyes set on Brazil, so... <laughs> No, no. Sorry, no, no. <laughs> but I, I just didn't notice it myself. So that's all fine. right, guys. I'm just gonna say we need to start seeing fat stacks, fat infantry stacks, landing on the coast well, of Europe. Well, let's see now. Let's see now. Can we? Can we stack? Can we stack west? Right? So, I don't yes. think so. You don't think so? He has. Let's let's see how much does he have. He has. Uh, yeah, probably not. Twenty five. He has fourteen, 20, has 14 uh, infantry, five artillery, eight tanks. Twenty eight. Three fighters and a bomber. Um. Yeah. We can't, we can't man. Twenty two, twenty five, twenty six. Man, it's close. Um, yeah, I didn't realize it. I didn't realize it was that close. Uh, should have maybe attacked with the US. Okay, well. Uh, yeah, I think I think a couple times we probably should have just taken it with US. Or at least Ukraine with US. All right, we just. I guess I guess we just trade. Wait, let me, let me let me actually check this. Let me check this because this is interesting. Um, oh, uh, no, yeah, okay, okay, yeah, just just, just trade Ukraine and and West Russia, I guess. Um, Ukraine, you you, I guess you trade with one or two or two infantry or something like. that. All right, I'm going to buy four infantry, two artillery this turn. Yeah, sounds good. Um, we want to trade any of these Japanese territories. Mm, well, depends, depends uh, who can spare the planes. I have three planes. I, yeah, uh, trade, don't trade all of them. Just, uh, just hit, uh, what is it, Vologda? Yeah, Vologda. Uh, hit Vologda uh, with just one guy and then I guess one plane. Is it like three guys in an artillery in Ukraine? No, two. Two is enough. Because he's got two dudes there. Uh, three guys, West Russia, for the plane, or two guys? No, 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 no. No, uh, no, no, two, two is, uh, you can, yeah, two guys and two planes in West, West Russia. All right, it's just sketchy if he gets two hits. I mean, yeah, okay, okay, I see, I see what you're saying. If we can get through, then we need to suddenly move everything to... Yeah. Well, not everything. I mean, he he only can hit the air with the planes and tanks, so... It's not the end of the world. Definitely... I guess you can send you can send the third guy, yeah. You can we send... definitely have to go into Moscow. <laughs> that happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, sure, sure. But yeah, okay. So oh, we need, we need to. Yeah. Well, thing is, actually, we need to actually worry about this Japanese dude in Volokta as well. Then. Uh, well, I was gonna hit him. No, we don't have to worry about him, right? We just need to get him killed. You can. I'm just thinking you can hit the guy in Volokta with 
with actually more stuff. You can hit it with that with three guys in this tank. Because he can he can hit back only one guy in planes. So if he wants to snap his planes, you know, sure. What guy? The Nova Novo guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and the yeah. Oh, oh boy, we're getting spicy over here. I also have a plane. No, no, plane you can use in uh, in West Russia. I am using two planes in West Russia. Oh, oh you use, use three. Don't forget your, use three. Don't use forget three your planes. Ukraine battle. Oh, yeah, it. yeah, Ukraine, Ukraine, you will send the... Uh... Oh, what happened there? It must have accidentally okay, got one guy. You, you, you sent him back. <laughs> he didn't want to go. He, didn't want, he, he refuses. He's a pacifist. All right, all right. Again, I'm ringing the bell here as Russia. Bat stack. Bat stacks, baby. All right, Ukraine's unlikely, by the way. Unlikely, yeah. Let's see. Let me, let me, let me, let me check for a sec here, Ukraine. Mm. He has an AA gun there. No, it's, no, it's okay. He, no, it's okay. It's okay. All right. it, we don't need to necessarily capture it. Yeah, Ukraine. we don't need to capture it. Yeah, yeah. Agree. We're going to start in Vologda. We'll see if we need it. Uh, I guess we could have waited. Damn it. All good. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> wow. Well, everybody missed. <laughs> Friendly. Friendly battle. Yeah, this is crazy. There's fisty cuffs in over here. <laughs> okay. Literally only two hits. Yeah. Out of all that. All right. Okay, good deal. Whew breathe again all right yeah i guess just back to caucus here yeah why not do we uh do we actually want to go to moscow this turn no okay, yeah, it's fine. i guess how many guys in caucus do you want to make four four yeah of course or put it all in moscow because you can hit archangel we're not gonna put uh no no that, that's okay that's okay i yeah, I'll put. You can put one artillery, I guess, in Moscow. In Moscow. Yeah, one, three, one and three in Caucasus. Yeah. All right, we need fat stacks, my homies. Well, I must say that I'm happy that they lost the uh, two bombers. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. I'm much. sure you are. <laughs> That definitely helps. It does, because I have to pretty much just build infantry and like game glitch out and it shows the Russian territory is still won by Germany. I think it's funny. <laughs> yeah, there's a glitch that, that that happens with that sometimes, right? <laughs> there's every load. I can get eleven infantry. And and since can... it's round five, now we got to consider the uh, VC victory. Yeah, I don't I don't know. If, I was looking at that. I don't know if we could hold France, Berlin, and Italy right now. I think it's um, definitely easy to hold um, Korea. It's just a matter of how do we redistribute. Because I can only put seven units in Germany this, this round, and I can only build the 11. Well, um... Probably, he probably won't bomb. be bombing us as much in the future, but <laughs> for now, that's all I got. Um, let's see. Yeah, I guess that's fine. Um, I mean, that's my build. That's really all I can build, right? 
you just basically you have to um you have to win Baltic states so you can send tanks to yes, um Germany, to Germany or you have to build or you have to repair the factory more whichever one whichever no the tanks the tank some of those tanks need to come back I don't do you think I don't know if all of them need to come back but some of them yeah definitely. part of all of them because okay. we, we want to we're going to put that whole stack of Berlin into um, France. No, no, no. Do the, the, the Belarusia. We want the Belarusias to attack Baltic states. I thought we needed them in uh, Aurelia. Especially since we're taking those tanks off of there. Because we also need, yeah, to, but... we need to take Ukraine. Yeah, so USA can't, it's just England you're protecting it from, because USA can't really do nothing in Karelia. Yeah, yeah, I guess you're right, I guess, I guess. Let's get an artillery there, too. And now I have to, what about, uh, what's uh, Russia we want? I wouldn't even want, do what? any other attack. I, I wouldn't even focus on Ukraine. I would just put all our money on the on the VC. But well, we gotta take Ukraine. No, we, we don't need to if we won the game. You know, just he's, he's gonna stop us from getting the, the VC. How is he gonna stop us? They don't have a lot of units. As long as Berlin doesn't fall, we'll probably won the VC. As long as... Well... He, well they're, they're well Honolulu is not a guarantee. That's, that's the thing I'm saying here I guess it is I guess all right I guess I guess all right all right let's put let's bet the farm on that I guess all right so just put everything in Baltic from hello um fair um yeah but you, you just want to make sure you won Baltic so, so you want uh, at least two infantry no not uh, everything just two well, what are we doing three. with well, what are we doing with the rest? The rest is going to go to Karelia, and then you're going to send your tanks to Berlin. We'll send we'll send a bunch there. Well, you just need two. No, you, you, you... no we need three. It's a, it needs to be a guarantee. It has to be. Yeah, 100. but you send them like it has to be two, three, four. It has to be hundred percent. It's got to be hundred yeah, percent, like, man. You send like all those planes, you'll be fine. It's gotta be 100%. Okay. So if you wanna do that, then just take out an infantry and trade it with artillery. That's better. Instead of sending three ground, you're just doing two infantry and one artillery. But uh, the, the extra infantry isn't really concerning you, is it? Instead of sending two, I'm sending no, three. Saying, it's, it shouldn't be that, that big of a deal. I know, I'm saying if you're gonna do that, it's more effective to do two infantry with one artillery. I guess I, could send, I, guess I could send an artillery, I guess. So you still send in three, you just swap in infantry with an artillery. See, I always think long game. I don't I don't ever think like short game like that. And then basically everything from Berlin is going to France. So then you can um try to attack South not, Europe. Well not just everything. Infantry. We can't send everything, can we? What what can he come into Berlin yeah, with? Yeah, everything from Berlin is yes. Because it's only UK that can really attack. Well, Berlin. the U.S. does have an assault, though. It, the U.S. has an assault. It, it, yeah, not really, though. It, but it, even if they're able they to pick off... But let's say they're able to pick off five units. We need to account for that. Sure. You got, you got, you got Japanese here coming in if you need help. But just um, send one infantry with the and send the rest of the air to um, Southern Europe. And send your ground to France. Because there's just one guy there. Well, there's two guys there, but... In France, there's one guy. Oh, I thought you said Southern Europe. Yeah, you want to attack Southern Europe with one infantry. Mm -hmm. Because, you, and then you send all your air there. That's not attacking Southern Europe or Baltic States. I don't know. Uh, hold on, hold on. Yeah, you... I was saying 13. I don't know if this Berlin, is going to work, man. I, I don't know if and that's going to work. Uh, and you said one infantry from Italy 
to Southern Europe. my dudes fat stacks we're ringing the bell in moscow i don't know i think he's going to be able to get france back that's that's the thing here or italy he's going to be able to get one or the other it's going to cost him a lot though it's 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 going to be um, very difficult for him to take france it's yeah i know really i know easy. my only concern is that now the the soviet union is going to become a monster yeah. If this doesn't well, work out, have... if it doesn't work out, if all of this stuff doesn't work out, you know what I'm saying? They're going to become mm -hmm. a monster. Alright. Anything else? Anything else we should do here? That looks good to me. Yeah, I think this is risky, but let's go. Let's go for it. Risky means it could work out. So if USA would have prepped if we take for Hawaii, then we wouldn't go for it. But because Hawaii, um, I'm surprised USA that they didn't. Know, I, yeah, I'm surprised that they didn't yeah. like put like a bomber there and that, another sub or something. Yeah, so that's why we're going for this play. We gotta punish them. Two hits in Southern Europe. <laughs> I... That's fine, this is bomber. Oh, you did not send a bomber? No, that's bomber you wasn't sent... there. Yeah. You let... Oh, you are supposed to send the bomber in. That's what's fine. up, little man, little green man. Yeah, you, 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 you... See, I wouldn't have it's done that. I would, I, would have, I would have just ignored it, you know? I would have just ignored it. He was not done with his Croatian mission. Yeah. You're supposed to send all your air, because those are two infantry that can help attack Berlin or... So it's really important to clear that the, the units there. You were supposed to send the bomber and the fighters there. Did you lose any planes or you just... No. Well, I guess at least you didn't lose planes. You just went one for one. So then you just... You probably want to put your fighters into... Um, in Italy, all of them? Yeah. Yeah, put your air in Italy. Sure, Berlin's safe, man. Oh. Yeah, and then, yeah, Berlin would be fine. It's, it's basically just UK. I know, but it's. And you know, because, it's... because the reason why is if UK does a one two punch, Japan will clean up the rest of US. I'll be able to clean them up. All right, all right. And all then right, you want right. to put some more units from Italy into um, France. So definitely want to put your AM guns. Because if they're going to win two something, it's most likely going to be um, France. They're going to win two. But then they're going to be able to take Italy, man. I don't know. <laughs> this is... I don't know, man. It, it, it's hard for them to do that because Japan goes before US. All right. How many do we need um, in France? Yeah. He's got um, eight. Nine, 13, 14, oh, send more into France. 15, 17, 15. Yeah, we need like Christ. So the UK can also. Can you move the tank to France? Yeah, but uh, I mean, he he can bring like 15 units into Italy, 16 units into Italy. You'd be fine. All right. What? Everything look good. Uh, let me just try to think. I, th I think um, France looks okay. 
Wait, France, think? France should be it's okay. Me. Because right. he got, he got five, six, seven, eight, plus the fifteen. That's he can bring like twenty-two, I think, with all of his, with everything. Twenty. Maybe right. he can bring like twenty-five into France, but that's a one-two punch. So yeah, we should be good then. Yeah, that should be fine. That should be. Fine. It's it's Italy. I'm a little more concerned about, but let's see, let's see what happens. All right. All right. <clears throat> Let's see it, allies. I probably don't have enough time to finish this game. I'm going to have to head out, but it's nice playing with you guys. Oh, well, you're heading out now? This may be yeah. the last turn, my friend. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, thanks. Well, I'll, thanks I'll, I'll stay on board, but I don't... I can't bring my PC with me. I gotta go drive. That's all right. That's all right. So good. Just make sure you relinquish your uh, control of Japan over to me, so I could yeah. close out the game. See, you, dude. It was very interesting. Thank you. All right, my boys. Yeah, maybe. Uh, maybe we can go to bed early today. <laughs> <laughs> save us here let's let's see <laughs> let's try let's try we, we have some some work to do yeah that is for real um yeah i don't know we don't got enough fat sacks I mean, uh, <laughs> yeah, you need fat stacks, right? I told you about the fat stacks, you guys. You told me, yeah. I told you, we need the fat stacks. <laughs> yeah, I guess, I guess you did. <laughs> uh, U.S. maybe has a shot on you. Let's see. This thing. Yeah, I'm doing a little, uh. Number crunching here. Yeah, I think really uh, this is probably the best. <laughs> to you could take fourteen to France with a bombard from a cruiser. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Germany is sixty two percent. We can take Whoa. it. Yeah, straight up UK. No, with with US. With U.S. help, okay. Counting or Japanese planes. Counting Japanese planes, but what if yes. those Japanese planes kill U.S. troops? Technically, they could do that. Yeah. Yeah, they could. That's <laughs> that's pretty like second level thinking here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, wait. Um... Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Hmm. Let's see. Gets bring an extra two fighters at Corellia, and then that may be four. Yeah. Oh no, no, I don't think you're gonna win it. And then U.S. can kind of hit it. <laughs> 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 
<clears throat> let's see. Let's see. Let me check it. Let me check it. <clears throat> Yeah, it's almost like you have to go for go for France, right? And then that'll force Japan to, to choose between oh. putting his fighters in France or putting his fighters in Italy. That's what I was thinking. And then whatever whatever yeah. one he doesn't, then US can hit. Yeah, I think you're probably right about that. Yeah, and then it, it pres at least it will preserve the navies, you know, so you won't be able to rogue out. <laughs> yeah. I just need to make sure his bombers don't take out my uh, 13 fleet. Yeah. That's, a, that's about the only thing I could think of and probably in hindsight probably shouldn't have bombed brought that bomber back and and prepared better for the Hawaiian VC snipe right but he's got a lot coming up he's got the Aussie stuff the Zealand stuff so he's gonna have two battleships so I would have needed. Uh, I mean, I mean, preventing preventing the Hawaii taking Hawaii is 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 quite difficult. I mean, it's I mean, it, it requires a lot of resources. Basically, it's possible, but it takes a lot of resources. Yeah, a lot of possible. I have to say that that that's that is it's it's been really really long time ago when when this happened to me last time. So I was a little bit. Uh, <laughs> a little bit maybe surprised by this. Usually, usually they can't pull it off. But I think I think here one 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 thing that that led to is to it, it was was that we lost India in turn three, which was which is like really early. Normally, yeah. you would not lose India that early. So that was yeah, that was oh, that's sort of it. I, I this I I recognize this this uh, who's this General Blitz. General Blitz is kind of uh, has this strategy for when he plays Japan. He definitely he, he puts a hell of a lot of pressure on on India, and then I think where he the genius of his move there was not to press Africa and then to come back into get all the uh, Australia and New Zealand pieces. So the minute he did that is when we should have prepped, you know, but even then that's still a lot of resources. We would have lost, we would have need princes. We needed uh, fat stacks. In, we needed yeah. fat stacks in Europe. That's what we needed. Yeah. Cause we can't, we can't have France <laughs> with 16 dudes, Italy with seven dudes and Corelli with 11 dudes. And also not be protecting Hawaii. Yeah. yeah. We yeah, need a fat stack. No, I, I, <laughs> no, the thing is, uh, I, I think, I think that normally the, the way that I would have played it, uh, it's, it's possible to hold India at least until turn six or so. That was, that was just a sort of an oversight. It was, yeah. We just, that, we oversighted India because we didn't have a coordinated yeah. defense there because of the way things had gone elsewhere. Exactly. Yeah. And we didn't put enough yeah, defense. Yeah. Anyway, like, we yeah. Still I personally forgot about India, so... <laughs> yeah, I think it, India was forgotten, to be honest. It just... Yeah. yeah. Anyway, um, but, I'm thinking your best chance, so, you so guys... situation in Europe... It, it generally, I would say situation in Europe is not bad. It's just that because of India, they are, they are able to do this sort of a one-turn thing here right now, uh, yeah. which is which we're sort of not prepared for. <laughs> 
Alright, I think All your right, best chance so, is to, uh, I think your best chance is to hit France and throw two fighters at it. What? To throw You you have two fighters in caucus, right? What do you say? You have two fighters in caucus, they can't hit France. Yeah. So I think you actually just try to get yeah. some hits on Italy because you need to also figure out how to get that stack as low as possible. You know what I mean? <clears throat> yeah. I think it's that dire. Let me think for it. You know, actually, I'm thinking, um, no, wait a second. No, I, I have to actually hit, um, uh, I can't figure out it correctly. I, I think I did. I have to hit, hit Berlin because I, I have actually 62% of the UK no, to take no. it. So basically... How? You you 6%, right? No, no, no. No, 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 no. 62%. And if I don't take it, then, uh, then you still have a chance to take either Germany or Italy. I mean, he, he will, you know, protect something, but I think... I, th yeah, I think yeah, this is better chance yeah, than France, yeah, yeah, because France, yeah, 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 yeah. France is like a two or well, Are you sure? Uh, it's because so, of extra planes. Yeah, I have seven fighters that can hit uh, Germany. Yeah. Seven and fighters in the bomber. Only five hit France. Let's see, hold on. Let's yes, exactly. Well, let, me just, let, me just, let, me just, let me just confirm. Let me confirm the accounting. We we can we can maybe even take Germany or I I'll try. You, right you now. might get it. So, you might get it because you're going to sacrifice all of your yeah. dudes. It's it's fifty seven percent, which I think is right now the best <clears throat> percent we can get. <laughs> no, your your percent is wrong. My percent is correct. <laughs> it's uh, oh, it, because I I didn't add the cruiser in, so that little bonus cruiser shot is where you're getting it. Yes. Yeah. Cruiser is good. I, I, I was I was too I was too lazy to do an amphibious. <laughs> Uh, mm -hmm. and then France is not looking great. <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah, personally, I thought this move was a little too ambitious, but, um, I was no, interested I, to see I how it turned out. I was yeah. interested to see how it turns out, so. Yeah. Here we like, are. It, well, no, there are probably no, was, some micro amount of numbers. I think the numbers. move was interesting. The move is right, I think. There's some micro amount of numbers, like... You might have like two more than you need in it's France. To be like over one more. France a little bit. Yeah, I think I think France is overprotected. Yeah. I like know. Maybe I, just I, the A like the AA gun in Berlin, maybe. I you know. know like, I know. I that's. Think it's like, that's that's where. I think it's a matter of like one guy somewhere just in being that's, in Berlin. That's where that's where we weren't really agreeing. I was like, I don't yeah. need that much in France, but. Uh, no, but France also needs a lot because he can hit France with the most. Deep I know. I know. Yeah, yeah. But like one okay, one extra infantry in Berlin drops it from 50, 62 to like 40 something. 39 and a half. Yeah. It, that sounds that's what right. I'm saying. That like sounds it, right. I'm saying like if you sat here and ran all the accounting numbers, you guys could have We should have like ran it. I should have run it through all through a calculator. Yeah. You're right. That yeah, that's yeah, yeah. I should have done but that. But we're like we're blitzing, you know. You got to just make some decisions. I know. I know.
but but what I'm saying, like, I think his play was right. I think it's like literally like one infantry he, could be the difference here. He's an interesting know? player and he's a good player, but he and I have like completely different styles. Yeah, funny, Every time we're teamed up, we just never agree on anything. It's funny when you guys are on the same team. You guys have to, like, negotiate, like, a pet attack. <laughs> You're like, I want to do this. Because you did that one that I didn't like, I'm going to go and do this one. Well, when I say things like that, it's usually that, that the, you know, battle might have okay. made my decision, you know. I know, I know, yeah. It's not like I'm trying to go tit for tat with the guy, you know. I, mean? I know, I know. It's just funny when you guys are on the same team. Quid pro quo. You, 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 you guys have such a, a funny... Like, he's like he's player. very aggressive, and I I like to be more conservative. But in this game, yeah. I think I wanted him to be a little more aggressive, and he was trying to ease back a bit. So I thought that was interesting. I thought uh -huh. it was interesting. Yeah, I mean, he took he took India on turn three. He did, yeah. he did. But then he kind of turned the dial down on Japan. You know what I mean? Well, he set up this potential VC. He did, he did. <laughs> and I was looking at it before he even said it. I was looking at it. I was like, can we do this? Can we? I think Berlin is the best attack we have by like the micro adjustment of. Yeah, no doubt. Thin to win. Thin to win. No, no, this is not thin to win. This is take, <laughs> take to stay in the game. All right, I think I. Because it's not even over right. if we get this. It's Seventeen not... euros is unlikely. <laughs> unlikely. Yeah, well, it's like Let's under eighty percent. Like, unlikely right. is a don't hit like the button. Don't hit the button. Sixty to sixty-five percent. Wait for us to get in and see the throws. Throws are gonna hit. You already threw. Seven. Pretty good. Pretty good. All right, we I'm got through. The cruiser got the hit. Oh man. Yes. <laughs> All right, six. Going I like, well, I like well. where we're at. I think. Oh man. I think. Yeah, you guys got chance. some good dice. You got a little little luck in the dice there. Oof. All right. We're losing planes. It. Four. All right. Careful. Careful. Yeah. Careful, careful. No, you guys yeah. are going to get this now. No. Yeah. Well, as long as he doesn't mess up the casualties. No, he's. you guys are good. You got it. And yeah, we, now we get to play another 40 rounds. Hooray. No, no. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to concede this sure game now. you take now. the right fighters. Okay, oh, I don't think it's overtaking Berlin. I think it's like we get a chance now. You want me to take it back and play a little longer? I mean, I just like I I don't think it's necessarily, you know. We we can, but I think I think you're you're gonna be in quite difficult situation. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna yeah. just concede after this. Yeah. Yeah, allies are gonna have a really hard. Yeah. This, you're gonna, you, gonna you will give hard... red you give you will give Russia a chance to rampage a bit. That's what's gonna happen. Yeah. Th this this game is over. Yeah. It was a good. It was a good. It was a good. Yeah, you know, look interesting. Look at all the money that UK gets now. Yeah. I mean, they're gonna be freaking unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. It's just it's just we don't have the fat stacks in Europe where he can because he's got that stack in Corellia and he's got the stack in front and the stack in Italy. He's got a shit ton of units on the board. Like it's not like you know we took it and there's no more Germans left. I mean, no, they, he can, he, yeah. I mean, I mean, sure, he can take it back and then we we have another chance maybe. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't think so. The way well, maybe not the... next, next round, but <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, I, yeah. I think, I mean, yeah, I think that's that's it because yeah, yeah, that was that you guys, was you guys defeated us. Nice job, man. That was that was the money, the money shot. See, now I would have needed two or three more <laughs> yeah. infantry in there to even make it. Uh, yeah, you know, based on those rules. And then you would have just yeah, gotten it's, France. It's so hard to say. Yeah, you would have yeah, just gotten so France. Yeah, that was. Would have gotten France. Would have gotten Italy. You know, one of those. Well, that was an interesting game, guys. I really, I really enjoyed myself. So today. what, I, what I would say about that play is, I think the play was right, but I think you guys overprotected the wrong territory. I think the oh, whole okay. thing was really tight. I think it was all really tight. He also had to go, so he probably was like, "Let's just try it." <laughs> yeah, yeah. Which I understand that. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. yeah. That was amazing. That was an amazing attack. Nice work. I thought it was worth work, work, uh, trying for it since we had snipe on Hawaii. It's worth going for the 3C5. 
No, it was very interesting. It was a, uh, you know, took a shot. Yeah, I just, I just forgot that um, Berlin wasn't at full housing. I forgot about that because I, I, I was assuming we were going to add another 10 units there. No. Those three guys could have made the difference, yeah. Be close. There was like a 50-50. That was it. Game came down to it. Yeah, yeah if, if we were to spend another 5-10 minutes calculating... That's what we were saying. Just like, yeah, yeah, we just said that, yeah. We, yeah, we were, we were like, we could have been micro, like, our, one guy here, one guy there. You know, one plane here, the bomber there. You know, like, it, it's all those things. Like, you probably could have been maxed it. <laughs> it's just, it's just yeah, we ain't, we ain't got time for that right now. <laughs> <laughs> Good games, guys. Good games. GG. That was sweet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it came down to a coin toss. Felt pretty even at that point, you know, on a worse way. Yeah. No, it was a it was an interesting game, and we. Uh... We 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 all we all learned something today, <laughs> I think, about yeah, this. Absolutely. That was great. <laughs> Don't forget India. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of little... <laughs> Don't forget India. <laughs> little stuff is amazing. Alright guys, good game. I'm gonna take a little Alright, so we'll uh GG. Yeah, thanks guys. Bye. Talk to you later. Bye.